Run with it. We're making the video. We're making this. We're making the video. Hale. No sir. You can't I'm just come in, sir. You can't just come in, sir. You know. Mm. Me, no. You see, you know. So me put up my headphone. I me pack up everything. I me say, all right. I'm my time for come out. I but me have to go back. Me have to go back for my headphone. Yeah. For tell the people them say. <laughs> no, um, you no. come round here. Me can describe you. Well, in the side, say me now go barefoot because I advise him don't walk up and down barefoot. Right now, you used to it. <laughs> No, you know, you used to walk in your beer first. Yeah, that's true, that's true. So, him have on a nice arm um, sandals. Name brand slippers. Barcelona. Wait, name? Barcelona football sandals. Oh, the Barcelona football slippers. Yeah. Okay. Be not so sure if Muta would have worked with the name brand, but you don't know how to run Mushet, you name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, him have on a nice Barcelona slippers here, and that is to make up for the beer foot. And then, darling, when he pushed the door a while ago. <laughs> no, sir. <laughs> Mr. Mr. No, Mr. I don't remember when I was in full eh? African suit. I a brown man motor. He said, what's your name? Brown man in a one red, gold, and green. Wait, what's your name? No? Damn, vest. I want nice vest. That's in a run. I'm bad vest. That. Anyway, knitted vest. I would knit that for you. Okay. You know, so, member. Because <laughs> 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 if I did Muta, if Muta, Muta, that member. But the vest look no, wicked. A Ruta. Ruta, sorry. The vest is a knitted vest, you see? Red, gold, and green. And the epaulet them have is like leather. Yeah. And then you have a little packet, right? I want bad vest that in the run. Yeah. And then you have a nice little packet, two packet over the side here. Two leather packet with a little arm. Oh. <laughs> with a little, with a little arm. Um, knitted something on it. And then, him have on the black shirt, t-shirt, and that it. But that then lovely gold shade and a, and a pretty boy, something that, yes, no, put no, it no, in. No, you always have on it. You put it, you always have on the chain because you always is run, but now you're a rooter. What is wrong with the run, So you're going to put in the pretty boy chain, that a yeah. galley thing. So yeah. you're going to put in the chain. <laughs> Not a me them boy. So you're gonna put in, you're gonna put in the them gold chain. No, eh? no, for them girl. Them girl. Yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, them girl. Them so you're gonna put in the gold chain now yeah. and look more, me no know, rota ish. Yeah. Yeah, you look nice, man. Give you look like that. a nice prince Ruta. of his imperial majesty. Yes. Muta, anyway, you need a pro dime. Mr. Sam, do the best for him, can do him, they call me in. <laughs> No. <laughs> Darling, all yours now, Mr. Mushet. No, all yours. Me eh? No, me listen, man. Make me know so I listen the whole time. All right. Hold on. 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 War. You know, once you come on in, you know, so Babylon knows their problem all in idea. You know. So give thanks for all the listeners. Give thanks for joining us. I don't know, you know, a serious thing, you know. Interesting program ahead of us uh, coming up today, Thursday. This is Aiba Mar. Man giving thanks to Giant Man saying, Ja House, the mini mansion, you know. Some people go on and they don't understand and I move full, full in Idea. Like you know, say Jack Gray. You know, as a youth, I grew up in a West Milan and listened to Musa Baruka. Go oh, I mean, tell you, say. Even when I came to RFM, you know, it's like, yeah. I've done almost every other program on RFM except like the cutting edge. And then here comes Muta in the afternoon or doing what we call the stepping razor. And first time as I look at you down a West Milan late night, uh, then time they have a father, Jackie Mosher, then time they will live a Peter's field, you know. So them times, you know, live up a Peter's field more time as a night as a youth, you know, you just uh, learn to touch road, you know. Probably about 18. Eh, you just go on, you know, touch road and you moot up on the road at night. It's just a madman that you know, man. As a youth, I say, oh, never even know them day where that comes to. But after a while, I get to know Muta. And I come to know Muta and hear him tune them and say, yeah, Muta Baroka, real African warrior. And then when I came to Ari, you know, me Muta in the early beginning, me Muta couldn't really get along, you know, because the first day me come to Ari for me, you know, and me to come work right after Muta shift, you know. Walk in the studio, you know. Oh, 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 oh. How are you, man? He said, you come to Ari, so walk. Oh, how are you, man? I said, me I work here now, you know, sir. He said, what are you name? He said, my name is Ron Mushet, you know. I said, oh, all right. Well, people, I'm a man there saying, I'm Ron Mushet, you know. We don't really know him, you know, but he said, I'm Ron Mushet, you know. So, he might go come on, you know, you know. And him cut and gone, you know. And then after a while, final motor start showing me no respect as a youth and 
Nuff time Muta go up on the road. Muta send for me and call me. I say, yo, run my shit and all this here, you know. Bring me enough places. Me and him play music, laugh and talk. Me and Muta in up all the New York, you know, when the time cool, you know. And me and Muta in a limousine, I head for one show, you know. So when I step out, you know, I tell him, say, play school till I feel it through my shoes, you know. And a barefoot Muta scan coat, you know, yeah. And me and tell it through. So when I'm on about if Muta wear barefoot or foreign, they call me. They're in New York City already with Muta. I said, it's when me I try to hurry go in and I call. And my finger them my cramp up. Muta out of the door, take picture and I talk to people and I laugh. So I'm going to big up Muta wherever he is, you know, apart from the, you know, everything else, you know. And I give thanks for the opportunity, you know what I mean? So we have Sammy in here and we have a team and we have a nice show for you because, you see, today now, we're going to talk to a virgin real soon from Transport, from JUTC, right? What we're going to talk to you about, and we don't want to know about the bus them and thing, you know, because what we really want to know about the bus them, not going to really tell me. So I'm going to reason with him today, you know, Transport, virgin from up there. Where place them again, Sammy? JUTC. Because we're say people that misbehave in a day halfway tree transportation center and we want to know, learn a little bit more about that and see how we can bring the little picnic under control because we're going to go to school they're depend that you know school over you know and nobody seen a uniform you know so we don't really know what going on with them a picnic nowadays and nowadays all in a uniform all six seven o'clock in the road uh, move around first time we don't depend on the kind of bus there you know as a matter of fact as we are looking at a free drive we want to go you know we don't depend on bus we don't party you know rare you see what I say yeah no holy pa you know ramping shop we don't depend that's a speaking you know, man so anyway, we're going to talk to Mr. Clinton Clark from JUTC. And then later on, we're going to talk to a bridge named Kashif Lindo. Because the man is a big singer, you know. And see my foreign dead at the end of the man. I say, you know, seven, a one time you ever come to Jamaica? Kashif Lindo. One time. And also, we got Usain Bolt. Oh, well, Sammy, I've got to tell you whether or not we have Usain. All right, all right. Oh, you were supposed to be a surprise. When the man is true, so you get one. Ready, set, boom. The time by Boomer Energy Drink is... Uh, 17 minutes past 2 on RFM, and this is the Stepping Razor. Ran Mushet in for Muta Baruch, but today I call myself Ruta. Don't you, Gavin? Yeah. Big up yourself, my general, because a different kind of thing I go on in a day, you know. Yes, sir, this is the Stepping Razor. Yo, pretty the dance that new thing for you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, respect to all the people down in Westmoreland getting ready for the tribute down at uh, Natty Place down on Farm Westmoreland. Why that place is supposed to have some of the worst roads in Jamaica, may I tell you? So I don't even know if it's fixed. Maybe later on we'll open up the phone line, somebody can call from down because a long time in a touch on the place a mash up vehicle or that. May I tell you? So big up to everybody down in Farm and Belmont and Bluefields. Why me talk phone to tell me throat to why I even know right now? My horse. This is Stepping Razors. 2.23 p.m. is the time on IRFM. And uh, right now we're going to talk about some serious things that's going on with the nation's children right now, especially town picnic. You know what I mean? And, the, and, and the, yeah, the eastern side of the island. We have Mr. Clinton Clark, Marketing and Communications Manager at JUTC. Yeah. So we're going to link up Mr. Clinton now. Mr. Clinton Clark. And so my grandfather's name is Mr. Clark. Come let me know one a relative. You know. Mr. Clark, Clinton Clark, Marketing and Communications Manager at JUTC. Where's well, Mr. Clark? How are you, Ron? Oh, I'm, I'm good, good, you know, man. I'm good. You know, I'm my good. grandfather was Arville Clark. Let me say, yeah, probably some far cousin, you know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. Maybe. Yeah, my grandfather Maybe. named Arville Clark. I remember that name, Delcine Clark, man. Okay. So, you don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe. <laughs> maybe I'm a cousin, you know. So, any relative we have named Clark. So Your Clarks again. are from where, Ron? Um, well, my grandfather come from down a month ago, beside there, you know, St. James. Wow. Yeah. Wow. That's pretty close. I am from Hanover next door. Oh, I see Mr. Clark. The man they used to move around in at them time. They, you know. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I don't like them. I don't know. I used to take JUTC bus. You know, I used to walk and look at them girls. You know, man. All right, oh, my you, goodness. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mr. Clark, I want to talk to you about something that we've been reading in the newspapers about how children behaving badly at this $4.3 billion half rate tree transportation. I mean, I know so much money Babylon spent. $4.3 billion. So, yeah, yeah. what have you heard? What do you know about what's going on there? No, I'm um, actually run the transport centers there for all to utilize. In the JUTC provides a service um, of transporting our commuters from in, within the KMTR. So all the children and um, the adults and the the retirees, etc., the aged and, and disabled, uh, uh, utilize the transport center. Transport center, center yeah. Um, in in essence, the, the the problem that 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 exists at the transport center now is a case where um, our young lads tend to fall out of line. Um, 
in a very significant way. And that is something that needs nah, some, behave some amount of attention at this point. Um, we would like them to use the transport center, but we would also want them to do so in a disciplined manner. And as we speak, that is not the case. So we are making some effort to work with them. Like, like with what kind of efforts? With their parents, etc. Well, the first thing is to highlight the issues so that everybody knows, including that the parents. Can we say they fight every day and all these things? Then? Oh, my goodness. On a Friday evening, my understanding is that you can expect at least 20 of them um, to be in the police post. They fight, they bloodlet, they beat one another. They, they, are, they are pretty pretty um, vicious with one another. Yeah, so and they are prepared to take on the adults. So do you know what happens now? Yeah. The adults refuse to use the transport center because of this kind of behavior. So, so what are, so these are, the, these are the guys who are going to be um, leading. Leaders tomorrow. But the JUTC, yes, they okay. have a, JUTC kind of have like a leadership role on the transportation center, right? Eh? Well, the JUCTC happens to be a, 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 a tenant in the transportation Okay, so like basically, center, okay, right? so you run, run the thing. Yeah, so, the so, so what measures have been put in place? What's been done? I mean, I don't know. I mean, do you have surveillance cameras and stuff around there that see this there kind of action? There are surveillance cameras there. And bring and it to the like school and show the principal. Yes, and yes, and that is part of what we are going to be putting in place now. There was a release that indicated that. That's part of what we are going to be doing now. We are going to be taking the... The, the, the pictures are the, the footings of the Missing, unruly behavior, yeah. etc. And um, the, the schools will be provided with the footage so that they can take the disciplinary actions up, 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 up against those who violate the rules because there is an unwritten rule that says when you are in a particular uniform, right. you are supposed about to, to be in a particular that. way, you know? I was just about, we're talking to Mr. Clinton Clark, Marketing and Communications Manager, JUTC. Why? Because we've been hearing about some serious reports of children misbehaving in the JUTC run, halfway tree, transportation center and this is like really bad so we're talking to mr clark about the behavior now so mr clark you remember when you used to go to school and when school over you just want to go and go take off your uniform yes man um so, so i remember that i went to i went to Rossi's, um in hanover yeah so what do you think has led to this so-called degradation of respect for the school and in behavior and all of these things what, what do you think caused that well it's a reflection of the decadence in in, in parenting and parental guidance. Um, I couldn't dare do that kind of thing when I was a little young lad growing up because not only would my mother give me a reprimand, my big brother would do likewise. Yeah, man. And, and even and, big and people. Don't forget, don't forget daddy when he gets home yeah. from work. But more importantly, it took a community to grow a child yeah, man. and the, 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 the extended Lucy community there were the elders there who would be looking out for you and your bad behavior and they would put you in your place at that time you couldn't go home and say to mommy that this man or this woman talked to you and talked to you rough because they would want to know yeah but you one. can't try that now Mr. Clark you and, try to and, discipline and, a youngster right now in back out all erratic Okay. You know what I mean? Maybe have um, on a fire. I mean, I'm bad. So it's, it's it's a deeper problem than just what is going is. on. Maybe what we see reflecting at the transportation center. I mean, uh, maybe that's the same thing going on in the school. Because I mean, well, what, I'm how certain, can we fix I'm this? I'm pretty certain some of that has happened. Um, I have I have the 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 pleasure of being associated with a particular high school, I, uh, which will remain na um, nameless right now, in the Spanish town area. And I know that there has been a significant transformation in the behavior of the children there in recent times after the, um, I wouldn't say acquisition, after we were able to appoint a new principal there. He has been doing wonders. Oh, and yeah, so sometime I would just... Yeah. Dean yeah, I would just want to see, you know, uh, m more of our administrators become a little bit more vigilant with some of these youngsters because a lot of the times what they want run is some guidance, eh? True, And true, the, the guidance must come from home, um, but school has a role to play. And uh, the, the partnership, which I continue to, to speak about, is, is very, very important. It's father. very critical. We always talk about so fathers that, and the absence critical. of fathers. Oh, uh, yes. How, how did, I am, I, I am a PTA president in the Spanish town area where I live at Angels Primary, I'll say that. And 
um, that's something that I do whenever we have a meeting at Angels. I, I try to big up the fathers and I try to encourage the mothers who may not be along with the fathers again to get the fathers involved because yeah. that is so critical, you know. The, the, the children need to be guided not only by mommy. A grandfather, by, by a big uncle well. or somebody, man. There must be yeah, some, yeah. some form of... get um, some male um, guidance, man. In the lives, how, how do they treat... The, how do the children in the KMTI... How do they treat the JUTC buses? They, they, they treat them the same way they treat the bus park? Yeah, the transportation pretty much, pretty much you will them, find that they will go up. in and write up their I was here and all those yeah, things. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's a long time thing because those things used to happen from yeah, yeah, the days. Yeah. And, and for me, that is that is bad. But what is worse is when they behave the way they are behaving. We, we really don't want them to do that. We, we really want them to be respectful to the adults that that. Um, utilize the center because at the end of the day, you know, when these youngsters get into problem, they turn to the adults for help and yeah, guidance. Yeah, so yeah. And they need to, and yeah, they need to take the guidance before they get into the problem. having all sex and all these things in the transportation center. And all yeah, it. that is what I have been um, told. That, um, is the case. And Come on, children, know, it, they need to do better than that. They need, they need to, they need to improve their behavior. And you know, I, I say this because one of the problems that I have with it is that. In the high, in the primary schools now, we we would work as deacons with the children to try to get them into the traditional high schools. And a part of the problem that we are having now is that these these youngsters that who are doing these kind of things, whilst they all come from all the high schools in the KMTR and converge on the transportation center, oh, the too. ones who are, who are seemingly behaving very bad seem to come from the very prominent. High schools yeah, and you know, that's something better. that we need to take. We need to, yeah, we we need to take a stock of ourselves and and stop embarrassing the schools uh, because these are all very good schools. Yeah? Yes, very, man, very and, and, good and, and not and all the children behave like that. We're reading where no, it is also said that girls, uh, as uh, young as twelve years old, in the transportation center and halfway three girls were gonna let me down. Twelve year old in there with big man legs all wrap around big man one whole and run run away all security. Come on, so so what is it? So, so what? So what? So what's being done now to? I mean, to address this problem? Because this is a major well, problem, you know. We 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 work. We uh, we at the JUTC. We work. We are work, We're going to be working with the police in in terms yeah, of trying. Nobody to Nobody wants some to be arrested inside here. That's one. Yeah. But we. But more importantly, we are working on a program now, with, and that is to begin next week, where we are going to be going into the schools to schools. To yeah, address the, the, to the, the, the children and, and the, the school communities about the use of the buses and the use of the transport center, center and, and all of that sort of thing. Because 4 public billion education dollars? is very, very important. Billion? Education is important. Yeah. Yeah. Mr. Clark, I know you have to run into a meeting, but um, I mean, you seem like a good father. Just the way you talk, you can't say he's a man with an inner foolishness, you know. Yeah. So we just want to appeal to the children. Children, please take care of the buses, them. Take care of the transportation center and stop embarrassing your school. Stop what I and, your family, and, and your family, and your family, you know? and yourself. Yes, your family and yourself, you know. I, I would, we want them to behave themselves. Yeah, man, we love the them and we want them to behave themselves. You understand? Yes, And Mr. they need Clark. to understand. I heard um, a, a recent message at the, that, from the, the Prime Minister at a function where she said, With the girls, you need to tell the men that you can't learn two lessons at the same time. You can't learn two messages at the same time, uh, two, 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 two lessons at the same time. You'll need to learn your book and leave the other things until you become an adult. Thank you, you know? very much, Mr. Clark, yeah. and thank you, Prime Minister. And then, uh, one thing again, too, we have to appeal to again some of the worthless men them out there. Big worthless man. He yeah. can't get no woman, you know, but he have strength in little pitting them. <laughs> I'm going to tell you, say, all right, man. We soon take care of them, Mr. Clark. Thanks a lot, Clinton Clark, Marketing and Communications Manager at JUTC. Thank you, Mr. Clark, and uh, we hope we can have this problem fixed at the Half Retreat Transportation Center with the children going on like 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 young hooligans, and you know we, we don't like that. Thank you, Mr. Thanks Clark. For, thanks for having me, man. Thanks. Yes, sir. Good. I remember some of you are probably some far relative, you know, my grandfather named Arville Clark, and you near Mr. Clinton Clark. So you don't know if anything in my family, any little land, any little thing, Mr. Clark, don't remember me here. Going gone. Oh, I'm gonna tell you. We just spoke to Mr. Clark from uh, JUTC. We've been talking about how the children 
how they've been behaving up at the transportation center of uh, halfway tree. And, you know, seriously, as uh, as a person just like you, youngsters now who've been through the school system and everything like this, you know, one of the things we can tell you now as a youngster go to school right now, there's so many different influences, you know, and people have come to you with all kind of story and you go see all kind of pick me up, behave all kind of way. But one thing I can tell you this, you know, young girls or young boys. Remember, so every school have their old boy or old girl association, you know. And they normally have like them old boy and awards and everything like that, you know. Now you think when you behave like hooligan and like you are drink some mad puss, you know, and then I go and like say you're mad as a youngster and, and all of these things in the, in the prime of your life, you realize that there's going to be a tomorrow and there's going to be a time when you're going to leave this school and the school probably having some big function and calling all of the honorary students, they're not calling you, you know. Because, you know, I mean, your video show up a bus park. I mean, uh, some little young girls, you know, when I, you're a little age right now, you, you know, you go to school in a little uniform and you all kind of big man and all kind of people wrap up all about the place. You know, if you say one day you go grow up and somebody go want you to be a, them girlfriend or their wife. You know what I mean? I'm going to say, who is she? Huh, you know? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to say foot that, man. You know, you don't want the kind of thing attached to you, man. So be yourself and be a nice little young lady, man. And grow up decent. And all you little young youth, them. One of the things I'm going to see young youth take up on yourself right now where, I mean, even though it's been happening for years now, but, it's a thing we just get out of hand right now. This whole heap of drinking a liquor. You know what I mean? Every, most of the young people that we meet right now, every little party where you see a go on, and some of my company don't forget born out, you know. Because they seem to just be marketing to the underage, and then they might tell us, you must be 18 years old older to drink, drink responsibly. After you push your rum in a little pit in the face, you tell him, say, you must drink responsibly. Poor June, I don't know more than drunk. Some of them boys have to get run with, you know. Big man thing. But anyway, youngsters, you know, man, I mean, me you not know, all, you know. But I, I mean, I used to go to school. I used to be young. Just where the middle of school, me and Samantha. You know what I mean? I used to go to school. I went up and hugging up and kissing when school done. When I graduation now, I mean, we go to prom and we dance. You see me, you know, graduation ball. You see me, so take care of yourself, man, because there's they're going to come a time when you're going to leave school. And you know what I mean? You'd like your school to respect you and send for you as an honorary old boy or honorary old girl. When you behave like hooligan, I know your school now wants to see you, you know. I mean, because I look at you, I go to Granville School, down a Montego Bay, I go to New Hope School, down a White House, I go to Herbert Morrison, see him come down a Moby R. Mannings. You know, if he said, what's the proud of me right now? Yeah, man, and I say, yeah, you know, we're having a function, we're not saying for run, we should. So, but me, we're going to go behave like you and fight every day and teeth and up there, smoke up all for ganja school and pants a drop off. And, you know, I mean, they don't want to see me. So, come on, man. Walk a good road, man, and let go a dirty road, man. Come on, children. Do better than that. This is Wayne J. And we got news coming up next. This is Stepping Rays of the Art of War. Yeah. Don't get this confused. Hey, hey. Me don't know what I'm thinking. Some you wonder is no drinking, no. Me no much sleep, me no insane. No alcohol can go in my brain. Eighteen or older. No give me no farm. I come with the clue with a soda. Eighteen or older. Me want my mother proud of me. About 13, 12. Man say, oh, my mother proud of me. Man say, nah, smoke no weed. Nah, drink no liquor. And you can do the same too as well, children. Because the whole world is ahead of you. You know, party and rum now and done, you know. You know, long rum about from before my grandfather. My grandfather's man used to drink rum, you know. And you see how much rum left. He'll all pick the, you know, so as youngsters, you don't have to worry about them things, man. Because rum now done, you know. No. A rum car slavery, you know, as Rasta always tell you, you know. Yeah, man. White people in the middle love rum, man. Europeans, them. And so, them can't go to nice sun to go plant the sugar cane for making their rum, you know. So, them slavery grandpa, them. So, all the rum. Black man shouldn't even trouble rum, you know. Yeah, man. A slavery drinks, man. It's 2.45, 15 to 3. Time for headlining. The step in razor. Yes, Evan. We're not the laughing thing in our stuff. We're not the laughing thing with you, know. Yeah, man. This is, this is Ruta. <laughs> tell somebody that let me just tell you something about Eva. Let me tell you something about the laughing thing, Rasta. <laughs> this is not a wake up call, Eva. Anyway, coming up next, we're going to be talking to one of the biggest stars, if not the biggest superstar in the world, Usain Bolt. No, undoubtedly the biggest star in the world, Usain Bolt. We're going to talk to Usain in about six minutes. Now, I know there have been many interviews around the world with Usain Bolt, but you know, so when Rasta I talk to Usain Bolt, it will be a different thing. You understand? Are you seeing can't compare so can't tell you not about them poor kid? 
<laughs> yeah, so you saying before we call you, you know, if, even if you have a plan to eat pork right now, just yeah, son, brush your eye teeth. Yeah, son, wash your eye hand. Yeah, it's a no pork show, you know. I mean, no, he's a man love a pork, you know. You see, you mean, no. So, world's number one, fastest man on the planet, Usain Bolt, coming up next right here on Step In Razor. Now, I met a lady this morning, Empress Nana Nana. I want to big up Caveman, Everton Caveman Moore. Empress Nana Nana is a lady that come all the way from, uh, well, she's African, living in the UK, big time lawyer. And uh, she said she just came to Jamaica because she's have nanny spirit on the side, say, you know what, I'm now. She'll leave all of that behind in all our one million pound house, you know. Yeah. Empress Nana Nana, I just want to big you up, you know, and she's got this song called Repatriation. You know what I mean? About the repatriation child. Because a lot of talking you now about reparation and all of that. And, you know, uh, like I heard a lady on the radio last night talking with Miguel Lon. So Miguel Lon about reparation. If we really talk about reparation, the first people to really talk about are the Haitians. Because you know, nobody don't decide they're going to get you wicked like Haiti. You know? So if we're talking about reparations, yeah, Haitian, I forget it. Can you see Haiti now? Haiti, is it just like how we asking other countries to pay we money you now for all of the things England and England friends them do to we? You know, say France is a wicked place. You know, say France asks Haiti to pay them back. I hope I'm money here to pay France, you know, man. Over hundred and billion dollars, you know. Yeah, so we're gonna need back the money from France to repeat them, you understand? But anyway, Empress, Nana, Nana. This is the stepping razor, art of war, the Muta bring me to Babylon, stay far. I never surrounded and I know you can. But we're cutting still. This is a step in Razor. Ron Mushed in for Muta Baruka. So today, you know, it says like Ruta. And listening to Chronics. Once away ain't giving up. And before you heard, Empress Nana Nana. Oh, I don't know that name. Empress Nana Nana. Now we got the fastest man in the world online right now, Usain Bolt. He's our biggest superstar here in the island. And around the world, it's like everywhere this man go. I, I, I don't know. It's like everywhere this man go right now. It's like standing of age and thousands of people. It's like we own Michael Jackson, you know? Yeah, but this Michael Jackson run fast. The other one just dance fast. You know what I mean? So uh, let's talk to Usain Bolt right now. I like to tell us if Usain it eat me some pork before you don't know. I'm going to take it off right now. Fastest man in the world. Let me let, let me try to see if I can get all your name now. Uh, Honorable, uh, tell me the name again, something. Honorable Dr. Usain Bolt. I got it right? Exactly, yeah. Oh, said Leo. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> All right, let me try again. All right. <laughs> Honorable Dr. Usain St. Louis. Let me let him go again. St. Leo Bolt. St. Leo Bolt. All right. Yeah. How are you doing, fastest man in the world? All right. Good, 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 good. Yeah, well, you know, this is this is Stepping Razor. So, Ran Mushet in for Muta. You, you know about Muta Baruka, don't you? Yeah, no, no, no. Uh, where you know about Muta? Let me hear where you know about Muta Baruka. Where you know about Muta now? Well, two things we know, be a foot and <laughs> I don't know what to say. I, I'm the twins of twins. <laughs> <laughs> <No>. <laughs> you, listen to, you listen to the last twins of twins one, you don't want to sell off, don't you? Yeah, but I'm the last one, man. Oh. So the man the connect one, so I look out for that one. Okay, okay. Uh, well, yeah. well, we're in Fimuta now, you know, so this is the stepping razor. So right now we just say, you know, he's a man, love your jerk pork or your pork or your, your whatever. <laughs> we so we say, if you eat a piece of pork for a man, and make sure you're fresh up before you come for the program. You know? <laughs> no, <laughs> it's no, man. I'm not pork, this man. <laughs> <laughs> well, we hear in the room and say somebody love your pork, you know, not you? Yeah, man, the check feed, man. Your check feed. Check you know, to the pork, yeah, man. But like my father said, you know, feed panny, though. <laughs> no, no, feed panny, well, check for the pork. All right. Fastest man in the world, you saying both. Why are you saying, Matthias, as a youth, as a Jamaican, Matthias, we're proud of you till we not even know what to do with yourself right now. Yeah, man, respect. Super proud. Respect. <laughs> From Sherwood content down in Trelawney. Now we see that you've launched your book now, Faster Than yeah. Lightning. Uh, Usain Bolt's autobiography. I mean, I have to ask if a book I sell. I mean, me said sell about <laughs> a million in 9.58 seconds. <laughs> I sure I sure hope so. Uh, put uh, tell a whole bunch of things in the book, so hopefully people will go and read it, understand? Yeah, but and learn a little bit more about the fastest man in the world. Your whole life story and everything from yeah, sure, yeah, sure keep with content. Keep it real. So the book available in Jamaica, though. You, you, anywhere you know, anywhere definitely that distribute the book. That if but you anybody know, listening now, can I say? In farm, in, in farm, I think you for sure will have it. You will the book. Books are you and I can't remember next two places. I would love to tell you, but yeah. we tweet it out. 
right. Which is uh, different. I think uh, next week supposed to come to the island. So as soon as it land, we will tweet it out to the public and make sure everybody knows what I want. All right, we're talking to the fastest man in the world. You're saying both Jamaica's biggest superstar. We call you with Jamaica Michael Jackson. Because he used to dance fast, you know. And you run fast, you know. Yeah. Yeah, and we just yeah. love yeah, we just love the fact that we see you all over the world meeting with some of the stars. Even the other day you were at what um one of them big tennis what was that again? The French Open, was it? French. Or was Open. it Wimbledon yeah, 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 one yeah. of them? French French Open. Yeah, man. Very good. So how you feel when you appear at them places you now? How you feel? You know, sir, you know, sir, you know, that's a very good look and I feel good about it because after going there and they explain to me that they don't really let any anybody come to these things to present awards oh, yeah. and I'm the first sports person so I've ever really done that. So for me it's just a, another stepping stone here. You know, phenomenal. Show that I really a phenomenal hard. man. So just wonderful. So when them people it's like when them people are them big function you want you saying both they don't have to fly you in, put you up at some big hotel and make sure you say you get all the room service, don't you? Yeah, them cheap like a star. <laughs> It's good. <laughs> <laughs> so take care, man. Take good care, man. man. Very that nice. Was a good look. Very nice. You saying <laughs> both. You know what? Evan Newt from the sports department just bring down a piece of paper a while ago. And it, the paper you're going to mash up, you're saying. The paper you're going to mash up. The paper you're going to mash up. As the fastest yeah, man. Course, the Honorable Dr. Bolt. You hear the man say no? The man say, your parents are known Seventh-day Adventists. So how you come to come? <laughs> so how you come to the folks or after? Yeah. <laughs> I know that. Uh, true story, I think. My mother, my mother had a problem. We had a slight problem with, with this when my mother got baptized, you know. Because oh. my mother didn't uh, charge fire upon the poor. But <laughs> for, I was, was stopped easy for about uh, uh, six months. <laughs> and then one day my father said, Yeah, what up? I just buy a new pot and cook it outside. <laughs> I can't cook it outside in our pot. So I just buy a new pot and cook it outside. So I can't violate the rules anyway. So <laughs> It work out. It work out. It work out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, Mr. McKay, I wait for read this book, you know, faster than lightning. Because if just talking to you so entertaining, may I have to read this book, man? <laughs> yeah, man. So urging everyone to go up to the bookstore up at UA or uh, the two other locations. You, you're saying gonna tweet that out by the end yeah, of this I'll interview. Tweet that out. And uh, within a few days, now you can get the book faster than lightning. So there are a few things that we want to talk to you about. We'll talk about the book and you being honorable doctor, you saying St. Leo Bolt. Uh, yeah. No, we want to talk about Sa- Samantha here at IRFM. Don't think you're a good driver. How comes you one crash two times already, man? Mash up two, two, Chris, Chris, <laughs> me, my man. <laughs> That's all them things, they're live things happening. You know? And I said, you know, the future, so let's have us go along with it, you understand, and give thanks to not, not happen it happened. So, you have a chauffeur now? No, I know. No, we drive, we drive slightly bigger cars. Okay. <laughs> and, and, and go cruise mode. Yeah, you know, but I would speed in again. Cause how many cars do you have now? Hmm? How many cars enough. do you have? Enough. 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 <laughs> you, you, Put it that way. You, you just get a nice gold one the other day, you know? Yeah, man. Nice, nice and smooth. That's yeah. for the special occasions. Oh. GTI, that's for the special occasions. Certain time you drive that out, don't you? Yeah, you can't drive it all the time. Yeah, everybody knows. I don't know. Don't know. <laughs> For the man, yeah, yeah, yo, yeah, my master, yo, boy. <laughs> stop, stop like that. No, the man, the man, stop like that. You can't. Take, take the money, you know. <laughs> no, no. That's the next question I'm about to ask you. Know, you know, being superstar, you're saying bold. Will last a man get to get see you forget to tear and say, yo, father, boy, you know. <laughs> Every day for the road. <laughs> Every day. Them just want to spot me. <laughs> Boy, you can't tell them to that, man. You know, brother, say, you come on the money to that. You man, you will not tell me, sir. Oh, you finna have that money. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, brother, I'm not bad. You must say, no, man, they can't tell me that. Man, that is there for about 10 minutes. <laughs> and other man to me have money, bro. That's the boy. That's it. I know. Oh, I know. Uh, Manchester United now nah, going too oh, good enough. Uh, uh, yeah, Manchester United now nah, going too good enough. Now nah, going too good. Yeah, 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 yeah. What, what do you think of the but, problem? You know, new coach. What do you think of the problem with Manchester United? Well, as I said, the coach, the coach just he make a big mistake. I think he changed all the whole time staff and he brought over his staff as a of and pretty much they got 
everybody knew. Oh, okay. So okay. I think that's all the big thing. So when him come now, him pretty much he had to do everything by himself. That was told and pretty much he got everybody knew. Oh, okay. So I okay. think that's all the big thing. So when him come now, him pretty much he had to do everything by himself. And now nobody to say, this is how Alex used to do it and get it right. He want to implement the same thing, but when you come on a big side, you have to keep some of the, the system. Yeah, keep man, the system, system. Going. Yeah, yeah, yeah of course. Because I don't feel he's, he's big enough to come in and do the same thing. Yeah. So, he are a good coach, but he's not Alex Standard or Mancini and them. And so. Yeah, he will add that too again. And very soon, the promise you see in both a place of football, because Jamaica need a, need a, a star, you know. And yeah, tell them they need, they need help. Yeah, they need the help. I think nothing about it, but the fact that I said nothing going on around to a longer time, so. You still are retired? You still a retire about 2016, like? Yeah, nothing. Something else about people. I said, we have to wear 17, so. We still have. As a big star yeah. now, you're saying, we don't really want to get too deep into this thing now, but you know we have to ask you, because people, this is the thing that's been discussed about the whole JADCO and the drug testing thing. Yeah, and yeah, thing. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Enough man of all, you probably feel say you. How do you feel about the whole thing? You know, sir, in short, you catch a lot of things when it comes to the drug thing, it's feel how we say it happened, but it happened. And we we gone through one case already and have established that it was a mistake. We have one more to start out. So looking forward to hearing the information on that. But when it comes to IWS, I was informed that uh, I think IWS, Wada came down and actually passed Jatko earlier. So when them come now, I try to investigate us. It, it just don't make sense. Yeah, and yeah, every yeah. athlete on on in the top 20 in the world, like Asaf and Sharon and all that, will get random drug tested. So even if Jack don't test, we have other, well, other IWF testing us anyway. So. Yeah, yeah. So we don't see what, yeah, that's, such a big deal. That's why they might try try point fingers now. Because we do get tested on a regular. Because a man like you, you're saying, because they, they, they even have they call even have what they call um, out of competition testing. You yeah, can do exactly. a yard and just see a man show up, don't you? Yeah, man, just any time, them see like. And just come, yeah, so many see what yeah. the big deal about it. But. Yeah, and, and they release a thing which a lot of people might not see, but I was the most tested at lead last season and season before that, so. Yeah. It's just a, a thing, but we don't know people stay, them always a try to find white fingers and try to find them. Genoa as Jamaicans. But uh, being, yeah, being you saying Bolt, the fastest man in the world, how many times they test you already from here? Since you've been running, how many times they, 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 they take samples or test you from here start already? I don't really keep tracking them because the way, the way they do it is that it's so random. So sometimes they breathe you and make you relax and, and next time they just always just in your skin. Every day they just come back to back. Sometimes they come twice a week. And next week, them come two times again. They won't see them for the mm-hmm. next two months. So, they try to mix it up all the time. So, they really try to come and also do the test when they, when they show they come. Sure, yeah. man. You see it, but John, I'm tell you, the way we rate it, we're not even going to fly pitch by you, know, my dad. <laughs> <laughs> no, I tell you, you see it, not even fly one pitch by Mr. Bolt, man, I tell you. How you, how you feel the other day when, when Marsh Shirley Big Sunday beat you, Blake? Up at the stadium there when you run for the trials there and Marsh Shirley. So, so we call him in a Marsh Shirley. Marsh Shirley. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Marsh Shirley, so you know, you and Blake. How you felt about that defeat there when. No, you know, I don't feel that way. You know, I always say that in life, you live and you learn. And sometimes you, you are get beat, no matter how big you feel you are, but all you deal with the defeat. All you deal with the defeat. You really count. Yeah. You understand? So for me, and you deal with I learned a lot from that, and then just bounce back when the time is right. I go pick up three medals up in England. Eh? Oh, yeah, the uh, yeah, yeah, greatest. Understand. <laughs> <laughs> they, they, we understand they want you in a movie. You're gonna be in a movie. They want you in a movie. Um, Samuel yeah, L. Jackson. Yeah. yeah, well, it's still in discussion. I'll make sure we have the time because I know training comes first. Yeah. So I'll we'll make sure we have the time and and so far that and everything is right and so we're still in discussion on that. I mean, no say he's a man travel around the world, you see, and you're ever busy. Yeah. Every now and again, we see some picture pop up with you at some countries where we never ever know them places they on the map. <laughs> I mean, and, and I know you make good money now, everything right, I know, I mean, but you don't get, how, you get a chance to enjoy, I mean, how much time do you get to stay in Jamaica, maybe relax, sleep in your bed later, drive, go check your friends then? You get them time? I got some time I've known, like, I get one month after, this, after the season, so it's my last week, so we just try to relax and 
try to enjoy the, the, the weekend and the weekdays, you know? Yeah. So, because next week's training Starbucks, so that's, that's, a, that's what's on the, the cards now. Jano, Jano. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're yeah, yeah. But you still touch the road, though, and go eat a food. Yeah, man. definitely. Yeah, man, definitely. I try, I try to live a normal life as much as possible. Yeah, man. I'm afraid I'm going to go to Hex. I will eat a one swim round. A one swim round. I swim round. That's what I'm going to say. I swim round. That's what I'm going to say. I'm going to go to Hex. I'm going to go fishing. I'm going to go fishing. I'm going to swim round. So, so, as a Jamaican superstar, though, what are you going to wear? Peer crow, eh? Yeah, man. You know what's that? Europe, Europe and Asia, so my lot of love, you understand? And yeah. London right now, full of love, so. Most places, majority of places that I get a lot of love. No, man, we mean like Jamaica, yeah, man. When it, we mean like when they're here. Oh, come on, they still, still give me love, man. But you know, the Jamaicans are, they might like to, so they don't care more than that. Like, yeah, they're busy, but you see a boat, you know. <laughs> and they both them in our Wall Street, but you see them are people to the corner of them eye because... Yeah, they want to see you know, And I look on your shoes. I want to see where yeah, you are, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, Jamaica style, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> but I mean, we just rate you, and we just really, really appreciate what you've done for our island yeah, and what you've done for Jamaica. And I mean, Jano from Trelawney. Uh, Evan from the sports wants to know what's your plans for the rest of the year. More training and then more, well, more yeah, events. Man, there's, more, there's more training and few sponsor work. And as I said, start training next week. So I'm not really looking forward to that, but you don't know yeah, if yeah, it does. Yeah. Life. <laughs> and uh, then we just go back into the work and do sponsor duty to do throughout the year. And let's look forward to the next co- upcoming season. Yes, sir. All right, you're saying give thanks. Uh, which tune which, 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 which are you going to bounce now? Because I know he's a man who is original. He's a world boss artist. He's a world boss. Runner, you know, the, 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 the European mode still. Yeah. Because I tell you the truth. Yeah. Because in Europe, I wait me up on the Malisar, Cyrus and them people that really are take Europe. So, really into that type of music now. So, so well, I a Miley, a man say a Miley Cyrus in my record, right? That's telling us the truth. And the truth, when you get Europe, that's all we hear. So, it kind of still into me in, in the system as a born person. <laughs> right now, I wait on the ground. But you don't know the guys are boss still have the truth now. They are still have to support all right, my boss. All right, the right. Virginia Patrick Bodo from Upper Kingston they do a nice tune in a tribute to Usain Bolt. You know, so we yeah. play it now as we we go. So we make right. Patrick Bodo. And thanks for talking to us, Usain. You are a general no and no problem. Honorable Doctor Usain Saint Leo Bolt. Well said, well said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. World's number <laughs> one superstar. Give thanks to General and Jack Guide and all the best here. All right, cool, man. Right, all right, Usain. Cool, cool. This is a tribute to the fastest man in the world. Lightning Bolt, number one in the world, number one from Jamaica, to the world. If you want to run this race, this ain't no fun. If you want to run, run, make me mash it and done. I am a lightning bolt, don't you watch my stars, that I'm dangerous. Dangerous I'm like a lightning bolt Don't you watch my sky Said I'm dead Step in raise or something I have to ask Sammy. Hey Sammy, me I tell you say, oh, in J- Jamaica is an interesting place to live in you know, because me I tell you say, in Jamaica right now we have a serious problem because especially with um, imported Japanese cars because enough of them have some little radios really in the car. Japan Japan radio can't pass 90 on the FM band you know. so because of that some little station get hype you know and I pay hype you know, more time you sit down and me and I drive and I listen to some station and I rest of me and someone I say hold them and this and this. sometimes you know, if you calm down on yourself you know man you calm down on yourself man this is RFM man Behave on yourself, man, and calm down. So that's a, that's one of the problems with the broadcasting commission. I mean, even the industry and commerce ministry have to fix car basically right now. You know, if you go to a place go buy a car, you know, say for example, I'm going to a Samantha car mart go buy a car right now, and then we get that car, we try to turn on the radio, we go listen to Ran Musheta, listen to Muta Baruch, and next thing here, I pay a foolish me I say Japanese, it only can pick up two stations. You never buy a radio if you pick up two stations. Plus, you have all some instructions in a car in a Japanese. Yeah, you bring back them car down your deal and tell the man, say, me don't speak Japanese, me done. Mm-hmm. Yeah, me I try to turn on a little TV and I care for your Japanese, me I say, me don't speak Japanese. So you are going, uh, you could, them things that can't happen nowhere else in our world, you know. Mm-hmm. So you see, because them little things are going to, little station get hyped, you know, but Rasta tell you if you cool, you know, man.
Because most of you hear them from one bag of rare, 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 you know, but a broadcasting commission of the Ministry of Commerce, you didn't really do their work, then you know, like a blight, but you're not going to last long, so just enjoy it. Okay? CIBC First Caribbean is committed to helping you get your dream home, vehicle, or land, but we also want to give you much more. All them, and all, and all them other legal stations, what me say? Straight 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 out of war, Ron Muschetti in for Muta Baroka, because you don't know, you know. Yeah, when we ask Andrea, say, Andrea, how come I end up on this program? You know, Andrea say, Muta say, specifically, you know. In general, say, you know, you, you know. Yeah, so, Muta say, the stepping razor is a cross between the running African and the wake up call. Some of them say, Muta, go and catch two of my style, you know. But anyway, it's stepping razor. We just spoke to Usain Bolt. Nice to get interview with the fastest man in the world, Usain Bolt. And we're talking a while ago about uh, us buying cars. Because see, Toyota now, Toyota recalling 800,000 vehicles. Yeah. So they want them to come in, to come fix airbag, Camry and Camry Hybrid, Avalon, Avalon, Avalon Hybrid, and Venza. 2012, 2013. Imagine just buy a car, and say, company want to go fix something. They want to go drive now. Well, I guess they'll provide you with something to drive. Harley Davidson, big bike company, recalling some Harley. So they want to fix the clutch. Yeah, here in Jamaica right now, we need to bring back some of them vehicles and we'll buy them at some of these places. And we can't buy radio. I'm, I'm turning it on, I can't pick up the station when we want to listen. You know what I mean? So I have to bring it back to the person we buy it from. Or I try to turn on the TV and I pay a Japanese writing message. I mean, I don't know which is the off switch from the... Uh, them think they can't go on anywhere else in the rest of No, so... The main thing that we have to talk about and broadcasting commission need to look on anything there. And um, I mean, industry, commerce people, them people, you know what I mean? Bringing in, it must be, can be some regulation or something, or I guess if people start take action, because if one or two or three people start care back in and say, oh, me nah, go work with every day, you know? I run my shirt, so why in and the dark must come to light? So it's why you're not a vampire, we walk at night? Because them said them going up over feet, each we run from right, but them lies are cut with you just like a knife. A tidal represent for run my shirt, and I and I worry upon a buck of Respect tidal, respect night. master one. Tidal was just on heart minor, soul to soul. With the Queen Elise Kelly. Big up, Mama. Straight from Ruta. I see them so brave and bold. <laughs> trying to take control. Mama just dropped on the wire again. <laughs> the arts of men are so cold. Trying to take Big up the Queen. Yes. Reggae. Radio. I mean. We you know. One more chance Another of mercy, this is a man called Jack Cotta, one of the biggest stars up in Canada. Big up Canada! Straight on the Stepping Razor, Ran Mushet in for Muta Baruka. And I also got lyrics like a bazooka. The truth, Sammy? Lord have mercy. Cause in it, cause in it, think where Sammy say. I see him so we go. You know, say not to dread. You know, say we no papi should dread. Like say anything, say Sammy say. I see him so we go. Yeah. Uh, big up to you, Jack Cutter. Uh, big up to a man called Mr. Uh, Havlan Honigan. Mr. Honigan, Havlan Honigan. You know, I know Mr. Havlan is 71 years old, you know. This is a man that I've known for a long time. Lived down a White House, Westmoreland, where I come from, you know. But he's a big man in the fishing industry, and he'll be given a special award by the Jamaican government. Yeah, when uh, 138 Jamaicans will be honored uh, next Monday for service to the nation at the National Honors and Awards Ceremony at King's House. So we say big up to Mr. Havlan Honigan for Nona White House Day. Uh, he's been in the fishing business. He's 71 and he's been in the fishing business 70 years ago. Yeah, when I find him one year early, really, I go to a seaside, man. Right? So, <laughs> no, I'm not true, man. Not a long time, you know, man, so I've learned, you know, the man, help. No, go back to the point now, especially for the youngsters listening to the radio. Earlier on, we talked to a man named Mr. Clark from up at JUTC because we get enough complaint about the children and how children nowadays are misbehave. School picnic and the bus park them. Enough for we little sister them, little girls them. It's a little big worthless man them. Come on, you know. You see, now, as a youth that grew up in a white house, and they man grow me as a little youth, you know. First time you all go to seaside as a little boy, you know, man. I must have land, see, you know. He might cut piece of switch, you know. And I run him, I run him back. I say, wait, Darren, where I go? And I say, you know, south of seaside, you know, I must have land. He must have spots in the way there. I say, no, I switch him, and I switch him. You have to take off and cut three holes, post off his girl, you know, man. Yeah, man, I have manners. It, it, but nowadays, man, I've learned to see a little boy in White House and I'm probably trying to rush him. I'm stoning him, I go for him. Because it's a whole different generation. But anyway, I feel proud of man, I've learned still. You know? Yeah, down in White House. So big him up for me, man. Man, I've learned honey gun. So we call him for a little boy, you know, man. I say, yeah, yeah, man, I've learned. Because when I grew up in you know, you used to have a place like the, um, 
the fisherman's cooperative down a white house there. He used to call it group. So my stepfather, him, you know, bed and Tim also try making one fishing pot. My stepfather, him, can't make pot good, you know. But he used to try making two little pot, them, and we used to send me out to go buy from Mars Havlan, and they go there and say, Mars Havlan! They don't send me come by one, one fishing line uh, and two hook. Uh, yeah, man. Man, they are 71 years old. Been in the fishing business 70 years, Mars Havlan. So when you see him step up next week to pick up his national honor, Man, I deserve it. Man, I've learned. 71. I watch him now, man. Only belly big in every party. It's like going to Caribbean choice. We take it in all. Listeners in Africa and everybody checking us out around the world. This is what we call the stepping raise of the art of war. Africa. Sweet, sweet Africa. Why? Well, sometimes we read and hear about stories coming from the continent. It's serious. They have a serious rhino problem. The animal the rhino, uh, they're killing them off like rapid in Kenya. Now, the government of Kenya even planning to start putting microchips in their horns. And try to track them and try to protect these animals because they really are dealing with them away in Africa. New footage. Uh, we now see new footage coming from the mall attack in Kenya. And it just shows the brutality of the gunmen when they, you know, attack the people at the Westgate Mall in Kenya. Uh, in Nairobi, Kenya just recently. New footage now. CC camera. And uh, these images, they're not easy at all, man. I tell you. Not, 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 not easy. I uh, just want to pick up everybody in Africa. I hope we can finally get it together on the continent. A uh, lot of discoveries going on in Africa. Places now discovering that they have oil, natural gas. And even some of the places with, um, you know, some of the uh, riches, diamond, gold. Uh, you should see how the people are living there. You know what I mean? Africa. Well, I'm going to tell you confident. The, the continent awaits her creators and big, strong people like you and me that can contribute a lot to Africa. We have to do whatever we can for just help the continent. Charles Taylor, former leader of Liberia. Now, Charles Taylor has been moved to a prison now. Where are you going now? UK? Yeah. He's been on some serious charges for genocide and aiding and abetting the rebels. And so they move him from where he was, I think somewhere across Europe side and bring him uh, to London. Uh, that's where they have him now. Well, England, basically. So that's what uh, the fate of Charles Taylor. In Jamaica, now the Ministry of Health. Now when the Ministry of Health have become one, we know. One of the latest things going on on the island right now. I mean, I know where some people get this from. I eat alligator rasta. I eat crocodile. You understand? I know, I know Jamaican that. But some things are going on in Jamaica right now. And, and, and that's not us. And that's how we are Jamaican. And that's how we grow. And little boy, yes, I'm an alligator. Yes, alligator. Hey, yeah. Yes, I'm a group. And yes, I'm an alley shark. Where we come from down the country, yes, I'm an alley shark. You might be hiding, you know. Remember, little boy, yes, I'm an alley shark. And he said, curry shark. Hey, you run as a little boy, you know. Curry shark. And look how man eat alligator. No one wants to low him. You know what I'm saying? You have a good thing to come in and see where look like eel. Call him Congre. You have someone eat all the congreen, a little boy, a group, and you someone eat congreen, and him can't come nowhere near you, you know? Yeah, Jamaica, come on, come on. All the man that we are growing, I mean, no one woman I do it, you know, because I mean, I think no woman brave enough to eat alligator. You can't bring that to the woman, man. I'm, man, I'm, I swear. Just the same way, you see the thing on your front, oh, you grab her. Jano, there's so many horror stories that people can't. So when I'm a virgin, I just see him this morning. The man say, yo, I'm nearly dead in a run. I say, what happened to you? The man say, Johnny, you know, say, grab her. You front, oh. Mash him up the hospital for you long, man. I mean, you see, grab a thing, the lower fire, grab a thing, you know. Grab a just like you eat alligator, you know. Said damage to the thing, you know. Because alligator is supposed to mash you up wicked, you know. Well, I mean, I know, I just I say. Now, the Ministry of Health, I warn Jamaicans now. I say, hear me now, no. Low mangoes meat. I warn. We're going to Jamaica. No, we can't. We say, PNP and JLP, but anything I reach, right? Can we show you how to block, you know? Can we show you how to block, you know? No. Mangoes meat. Now, head of the veterinary public health, uh, Dr. Lynette Peters, in an interview recently, stated that the ministry has received reports that mangoes meat, mangoes, huh? Serve up in a St. Thomas of Love, so at an annual festival, like mangoes festival. But <laughs> I don't understand this. Word, you know. St. Thomas is a good, good, nice, nice place. You know. Maybe I just want to smell it like mangoes. You know. St. Thomas, try all the mangoes, man, and tell them if you change the dirty ways here, man. And a ble- good, good St. Thomas, man. No, we are celebrate Morant be a rebellion. We are celebrate with heroes. Heritage Week. We are celebrate Nanny. And Nanny never eat no mangoes. We never see Paul Bogland, the man, the other man, the hunger up in a stony gut and Sam Sharp. The man, the man, no alligator. Come on, man. Salute to heroes and cut out the foolishness, man. Mangoes meat is being consumed mostly by men due to the belief that doing so will boost their sexual powers. Yeah, because I think he can't perform, you know. If he's a mangoose meat, I'm going to make you perform. Who tells a mangoose can't perform? For that you, if you go take mangoose power. Ah, spoil you need to What an easy, man. Ah, God. Man, I like mangoose meat, they want to perform. There are girls, tell you. Why? 
you know, you know, it's always interesting. Sometimes you hear women talking, a man, say, I go up and move, I'm going to eat mangoes, I'm going to drink Guinness, I'm going to burn up for more spliff, I'm going to take Viagra, I'm going to do, any girl not take nothing, you know? She just did that weird panic, you know? And I'm going to get an alligator, alligator egg. Come on, man, do better than that, man. I want to go to all Guinness where you used to drink, man. I will go blend up with roots, saucy period, I was strong back. I mean, I boy mangoes. You might go perform. You want eat mangoes? A tree girl, you might know say mangoes. You eat, you know. Just you know, if you cut that out, man. A serious note, no man. Be the man. Why sometimes be the man talk? You can't too believe him. Man. This we have to believe, you know. Cause be the man, good years in the tree. He will tell us any time mangoes and he not eat, you know. <laughs> Just be big up, you know. Be the man. No, I know him, you know. Be the easy, you know. But anyway, Grammy winning, Grammy winning DJ Be the man is scheduled to perform in Israel next month. The latest Jamaican actor performing in the Middle East country is down to perform at the Barbary in Tel Aviv on November 28th. Wow. Yellow Man performed there already, Israel Vibration and Ziggy. And now they sent for the king of the dance hall. Yeah. Can you say, Mr. Hattis, man, alive and in place. When I'm a bunny up, I'm bunny up, wicked up. So, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so, they sent for the Hattis, man, alive. Rasta. Being here, the best you go and go represent you and represent you good youth and come forward, you know. You want to come and come tell you all about things, you know. And Harry Belafonte, Lord have mercy, Harry Belafonte, we need to sue Harry, you know, take her somewhere we sang them. But anyway, Harry Belafonte is in trouble right now. Well, not really him. He's suing Martin Luther King's estate. Martin Luther King family must sue now because according to Harry, him and Martin Luther King used to be good friends. And him have some letters and some documents where them claims they are a thief in thief from Martin. Him claims him and Martin are the virgin and Martin gave them. Anyway, I don't know if I broke Harry, broke Harry, but Harry, I try to sell them. <laughs> if people then put up a little injunction and say, Harry, can not sell them? Ain't you no know Harry talk already. Well, you know, I'm going to do all in my powers to make sure I get to sell them because I didn't steal them. So I say, all right, Harry. Harry Belafonte. So Harry wants to sell them. Big case are going on between Harry Belafonte and the uh, family of Martin Luther King. That Harry have some documents, some letters, and some notes written by Martin Luther King. That Harry claimed Martin gave to him because they were good friends. And now at 86 year old, I mean, I said, well, Harry, I fight for more money again because Harry's supposed to die, right, you know. But we follow this case and tell you what's going on. Harry Belafonte and Martin Luther King. You know, you can't fight Martin Luther King family, you know, they might go in. Mm-hmm. Just like Michael Jackson. And, yeah, it look like they might go in, yeah, Harry. So I bet you know that. Yeah, that? I bet you know that, Harry. And uh, how was Harry Belafonte fighting? There's something else that I just remember about an excuse like this, you know. Harry Belafonte, a Sue Martin. Why Harry Belafonte is easy, you know? 86 years old and a Sue. <laughs> Why, I tell you. All right, step in razor. Nine minutes to four o'clock. We have Kashif Linda coming up next. Oh, we have Kashif already? All right, Kashif. All right, uh, we're testing Chino. That's it. Eat pizza bread and butter. There, we are coming, Kashi. What would you do if you won the super lottery so today? You know, we always talk about slavery and tell you that slavery is still going on around the world. There's a new report out today stating some places around the world where they say at least 30 million people are still living in slavery. And India, India has got one of the highest rates of human, you know, well, of slavery going on in the world. India, yeah, a lot of places around the world right now. I mean, you and I basically, two few we work where we work right now, we come like a slave, we are slave to, you know. But I mean, like real slavery. I mean, no freedom, can't go outside. You just have to eat what they give you. Some serious things are going on around the world, you know. But anyway, we got one of the biggest stars in the world, Kashif Lindo. We, we've been hearing about Kashif Lindo for many years. His father is one of, if not the, one of the best producers in reggae music. Willie Lindo and Kashif has been putting out hits after hits and albums and he's only been to Jamaica one time so I was up in foreign the other day I said Kashif I said you would come on I mean big star like you Jamaica people need to learn some more about Kashif Lindo so Kashif Lindo step in You must know, say your daddy is yeah, right. one of the greatest ever in the business. Producer Willie Lindo. How's daddy doing yeah, these days? Right. Say it again. How your daddy doing these days? How Mr. Willie Lindo he, doing these days? He's good, you know. Always working, you know. Always in the studio, putting out, putting out songs every time, man. Yeah, but every I, time, just on the work, same way. Willie Lindo, Kashif, although you're big, but now you still sound like a little Kashif, you know. Man. <laughs> you still maintain a little baby voice. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm sorry, everybody. Yeah, I am big man now in a cashier. 
Yeah. So how comes you've only ever been to Jamaica one time, Kashif Linda? How come how comes? Well, actually um two times, you know. Um the first time was a, a while back, you know. Um it was at White River in Ochin. Oh, which was which was a really wonderful experience. And then uh two thousand ten at um Capleton's um See what we call um, where we come from. That was the second oh, time I performed down here. From. So, yeah, so, so why yeah. haven't been in Jamaica more than that? Why? 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 That's a good question. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, mean, I wish on. I had the answer for that. Enough people, <laughs> you know? enough people but, at Jamaica you know, know Kashif Lindo, man. Say that again. Enough people in Jamaica know Kashif Lindo, so we say, I mean, come on. Why we not see Kashif? I man, I don't know, but I, you know. Nothing before the time. <laughs> so uh, I don't know what you're doing. All right. right. Kashif <laughs> Lindo. I remember, I remember when I was going to school and this song came out right on me. I tell you, so this was like one of the most played songs in Jamaica back in the time, man. Everybody wow. playing this song. First up, Kashif Lindo. <laughs> yeah, man. One of the things I want to ask you now, Kashif, because you're, 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 uh, well, when, when we first uh, got to know Kashif Lindo, you're, like we said, we were just a little boy singing. Mm-hmm. So we get to understand, so you grew up big now, even our father. Mm-hmm. You, you know, yeah. you know, our father, now, <laughs> your, your daddy, now, you get, get out your little baby and all of that. Yeah, yeah, I have a son. <laughs> you have a son? Yeah, how old is your son? Because you sound like a baby yourself, so we have to ask you these questions, you know. Well, what, what's on his six right now? So. Six. <laughs> six. Wow. Wow. Yeah, girl, Kashif. Yeah. So what's the latest project with Kashif Linda have right now, out there? Well, right now, um, the song you were playing for before, um, which was the latest single, Love Is Overdue, the cover version, um, you know, Gr- Gregory Isaac's song, which was a big hit, you know. So um, oh, yeah, that's yeah. my latest thing, but as 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 of now... I'm working on my next album and that's supposed to come out next year. Yeah, but you, you, you're you a big Michael Jackson fan. We can hear sometimes say he's, a, he's, a, he's like a, a little Michael Jackson yourself, you know. You're a big Michael Jackson yeah, fan, man. don't you? Yeah, yeah. I grew up listening to him a lot, man. A yeah. Lot. So, so, so we understand there's, an influence on me. there's an album out called Kashif Lindo Sing Michael Jackson tune in. It, it's called um, A Reggae Tribute to Michael Jackson. That's the title of the album. Okay, and that's so, available now for everybody can get a copy from Kashif. Yeah, Lindo. yeah, man. That's Kashif epic. Lindo. So, Kashif, you're still touring all and things that you, 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 apart from not coming to Jamaica, uh, you still tour, go around the world and perform and all the things that you just stay in Miami? Um, I haven't been around so much lately these days. I'm trying to work up on that right now, you know what I mean? So, that's why we're in the studio working hard to put out a lot of projects, a lot of albums and singles and things like that so we can we could get on the road, you know. So, oh, but okay. for the most part, we, we, you know, I've done most of my shows here in Florida, in South Florida. Yeah. So, so as a as a singer yourself, Kashif, I mean, know your sister in the music business. As a singer yourself, Kashif mm-hmm. Lindo, like, uh, I mean, who down in Jamaica you you like? You have to get a song from uh, which artist in the business you rate, Kashif? Man, I don't. You know, say I don't have a favorite artist, you know. But I'll I'll tell you. I love listening to everybody, but I'll tell you. One of the artists that come into mind is another artist that I grew up listening to, which is Barry Simon. Uh, you know, daddy, so daddy, daddy, yeah, 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 definitely. So Barry's Barry sure, you know. So like, a, like on Kashif Lindo iPod, now when you are far and on your iPod, you know what kind of tunes you have on it? I we just spoke to you saying Bolt and it's your Miley Cyrus him thing there, you know. Oh, Miley Cyrus on his iPod. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's how you say it. Um, uh, my lead, my listen to right now. So, what, what's on your iPod? Where you listen to Kashif Lindo? Wow, uh, I really, really have an iPod like that too. You know? <laughs> 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 I just listen to a bunch of. <laughs> I, 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 I just listen to a bunch of different genres, you know. Yeah, but so yeah, nothing in particular. Okay, but you have a whole heap of fans down in Jamaica and Kashif Lindo. So, I mean, I understand how it comes when I see like on some fest or you know. Even jazz and blues concert, cause I mean, I mean, everybody know Kashif Lindo is a big singer, so uh, that is a question we ask Kashif. Yeah, good question. Yeah. Find the answer. <laughs> yeah. So you're gonna have to tell your daddy, Mr. Willie Lindo. Tell him to so listen, man. Come at Jamaica, man. Do some promotion at Jamaica, man. Go around the place, maybe make some appearance on TV. So what? Uh, so you want to say girls? Yeah. You want to say girls in my Jamaica? I love you, Kashif. Yeah, 
Is that your try to tell me? Yeah, all of them. <laughs> a, a foreign girl is a love? Yeah, every, every, all girls, man. <laughs> Around the world. <laughs> all right, one thing we notice about you, Kashi, what I tell you, say, a man shy, though. Don't you? Yeah, uh, quiet. Oh, quiet. Quiet, <laughs> quiet is the word, you know. Oh, quiet, quiet. A little quiet. bit reserved. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Quiet, quiet. But when you, when 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 you're performing, uh, when you're singing, why well, you know, so quiet at all? I tell you. <laughs> well, that that's a different story, you know. <laughs> yes, sir. So, how can fans get in touch with you, Kashif Linda? How can fans get in touch and keep in touch with you? Because we know you have enough fans around the world. If they want to link Kashif Lindo, uh, how do you how do you link Kashif Lindo? Well, they can they can go to heavybeatreggae.com and all the information is, is on that website. That's our that's Heavy Beat Records website. It's heavybeatreggae.com. Yeah. And you can also check us out at um on the Facebook with Heavy Beat and Kashif Lindo on the Facebook and Twitter as well. But every information is on heavybeatreggae.com. Heavybeatreggae.com. Any information if you want to book Kashif Lindo, if you want to find out anything about Kashif Lindo or about Heavy Beat, heavybeatreggae.com. Yeah. 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 I, your sister is also, n- hey, listen, man, apart from your sister, pretty and nice in a Kashif. Me, I tell you, she can sing in you know? her. Your sister. Yeah, uh, she's, no, she's no joke. She's yeah. no joke. <laughs> I'm going to play a song, I'm gonna play a song no with joke. your sister in a little while, but how, how are things going for your sister? It's going pretty good, you know. She um she just released her album not that long ago and is getting some really really good reviews, you know. Yeah. So as I'm yeah, so she just not too long released a single off of her album recently, you know. So so definitely want to put a push on that one. But Nikisha as far as Lindo. her album is is phenomenal. It's very, it's great, great, great. Nikisha Lindo. Respect. Yeah. Hey, Kashif yeah, Lindo. Man. Well, your daddy is good, you're good, and your sister pretty. I mean, well, I mean, I tell you, next time I come to Florida, <laughs> I'm coming here. I'm coming to your house for dinner. Tell Nikisha, uh, come by for dinner here. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> but Kashif, your fans in Jamaica need to get in touch with you, man. So look out for them sending you messages or something from Heavy Beat, and we hope to yeah, see man. Jamaica performing soon. Kaya yeah, good you to know. Yeah, man. Give thanks, man. Give thanks, man. Give thanks. Superstar, Kashif Lindo. Big up, Kashif. And we keep playing the music. Enough love from all of us at Irish for Vanala, Jamaica. I hear you. Yeah, man. Bless up. Live with love. Everyone, respect you. Thanks for the support. You know, and keep supporting Heavy Beat. And Kashif Lindo and Nikisha Lindo. Yes, sir. Much love. Much love, Kashif. Yeah, right. And big up, Daddy and Sean yeah. and whole family. Eat your phone. Well, will do. Yeah, big up to Sean. Yes, sir. <laughs> Kashif Lind- Lindo Well, I kind of have a little Gregor sound You know what I mean uh, Yeah, he's a big boy now He started singing from a very tender age His father is Willie Lindo Kashif Lindo And uh, he can still hear the little baby nine voice you know? A big man doing it But he's a real powerful writer And a real powerful singer uh, You know what I mean Now a daddy He's like my son is only six years old <laughs> Respect Kashif Alright, so we're going to open up the phone lines right now on the Step-In Razor so you can get to Carleen and talk and tell you what I'm going with you right now. 974-5051, 974-5079 or 974-5043. True, Sammy? Yeah, Step, I'm going with you right now. 974-5051, 974-5079 or 974-5043. True, Sammy? Yeah, Step in. And I was telling you that uh, Kashif Sindo, K- Kashif Sindo, Kashif Lindo's sister, <laughs> uh, her name is Nikisha Lindo, really nice singer. Take a listen to her version of What a Feeling, and then we come to the phone line and tell me what I go on. Step in. Uh, by the way, still uh, hoping that they fix the road down in uh, Westmoreland, Jamaica. Well, so many places in Jamaica where the road need to fix it. But especially from Savlama going up and Peter Tosh Tribute coming up a farm. And when is that? Sunday? Okay, and drive by the road there, sir. Eight minutes past the hour. This is Nikisha Lindo. Yeah, my name is Nikisha Lindo. You know, there's a place I want to big up. Yeah, you know, touch and go. Yeah, you know, uh, White River. I want to big up everybody on White River because I'm my place. You know, White River. Go on, go on. Everything good. All right, that's step with step in in a dress. And uh, right by right river, when you go around White River, like you go up an exchange, just as you're about to take that left corner, if you go around to White River, there, there's a new place built up somewhere, you know, with a car washer or something over there. Why well, I stop on the road, they sit there, wait for somebody, I tell you, I'm here, I refer my blast over a car washer, you know. New place right at White River, there, from the left hand side going up to exchange, there. right hand side coming down. So, I'm big up over a car washer, you know. Yeah, come here, tell us when I play IRFM like we are in our work with IRFM. I tell you, 
Right now, if I did me one hour for me, I can't something come give me. I tell you, if I have half dozen hour for vehicle, I'm going wash up like hours. I'm mean, like, I'm going to support the thing. Anyway, we're going to take some calls now, Sammy. Ready? All right, Sammy says yes, you know. You know, so Sammy may have a record, isn't it? Got a chicken, may have jerk, you know. Step in. Step in. Step in. Like that love, Ruta. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Ruta, good afternoon. It's Princess K. Oh, Princess K. Well, may I tell you, welcome, man. Yeah. You're Step sounding in. good give at this time of the afternoon. Man, Ruta. A Ruta, you know. Different yeah. to Princess K. So, we love it. We love it. Bigger pistols. You know, Um, from the other day, I wanted to call in on Muta's when Muta was on, right, yeah, Ruta? Ruta you know, and Ruta. I, I just wanted to show, um, you know, with the whole Queen Africa protest that happened, you know, I just wanted to reach out and say, it's, it's a shame what's going on as far as, you know, the gay community and just people overall. It's like if we say we're not gay, it becomes like a whole yeah, demonstration. Yeah. You can't eat your food, you get cancelled off the show. Look, we're being tolerant. How we say is there is so much more important stuff for, for, you know, to be demonstrating about than this whole sexual preference thing. So it's just, yeah, just, uh, people, but you know, what, just ease up. You know, one thing I go on, Princess K, what I mean, I tell you, say, the gay thing get away right now that you don't even know who's straight for who lean, you know? Yeah, and, and you know, me say we'll be tolerant, you know, like we'll go out and I'll look for them and beat them up or hurt them. But if somebody say I'm not gay, it shouldn't be a problem, you know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, that's why so I mean, just that say, for them, stuff gay, our man. food are foreign, yeah. that hurts, man. Come on. Yeah, princess. So, princess, everything all right in the day, though? Don't everything you? good, quick, quick, car washing, knowledge square, turn up a lock on to ah, root us. Nah, so, nah, nah, I nah, nah, number one, bless us. Well, I move like I am a river, man, you know? Yeah, man, no, no. Um, Ruta, do you have any shoes? <laughs> Why you want to know that, no, data? I just want to know, no, because if you're going to do it in a Ruta, you have to do it proper. Well, <laughs> I put it in the hard work. Good. <laughs> I'm not telling you about shoes like that, Princess K. Give thanks, Princess. Blessed love, blessed All love. All right, blessed love. Step in. Well, I'm going to tell you, if I wait, I couldn't wait for company program if it's a step in. You know? What's up, man? Okay. Sammy, you know we can't work it out here. Step in. Wow. I'm Sammy, you know? Alright, so I guess this is mine. Step in. I the Ron Mushad. Step in, step in, step in. <laughs> Ron Mushad, I don't want to I would have saw <laughs> Relax. Why are you not telling the world that you need right now? I'm going to the ads. I'm going to run some more. I run about 15 for more time. I have to tell everybody to clean and clock in. Yeah, t- you Sa- turn up. Saba, I'm glad you called me, Saba, because remember some of you are in a war the other day. It's nice to know some of you are at peace there, Saba. No, man, I'm from China in a war, man. I'm from one of the Afghanistan. I chose. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if we in any form of war, I must. I must, I must, I must have a farm, a unity, which is, which is, some people may think a war. So it could never be war, because we don't have no gun, now. we don't have, no, have no physical, uh, uh, or no farm of altercation. No, sir. but Saba, you know, say, I'll know, you always send me a message and say, run, give some strength on the album, and Saba, you don't care, the album come give me a loan in the rasta. Yeah, no. All, right, all the months, the way you said to me, say, run, you know, I give you no strength until me have to come and say, Saba, take away yourself. You know, right. you know, say, I know you don't give me the album, Saba. Run, Lad. I promise you, next week, never pass. <laughs> because everybody say, run, say, no, why, Saba, too, me not, not you not play, say, me not come, come check it, you. Saba. And I can't say nothing at all, more than me for those. Uncheck you. Oh, you mean, Saba, may I have a from we don't have a hot one or two, don't have a little station? Then, then run, 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 remember, say, the first Berry Salmon and the first Jack you are going to ever play a me card in Congo. Lad. Lad. <laughs> <laughs> run, may I tell you, the place, turn up. You had a girl ask a while ago, she said, if you wear no shoes, because Kelly Skelly was promoting that. Run, saying, you went and come into the studio. Ruta, you shall have no shoes like Ruta. <laughs> yeah, I do. Saba, I'm near me. I'm on slippers. I'm near. All right. But all right. Just land that coward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But because right now, run. We don't come for some boy. I'm talking about a little thing about the children, them. In the bus. I know them are paid the extra money. They have them private um, dancing and them private love. I go on. Yeah. We don't say imagine in the bus. All school children in there and them have them are make love and nobody no business with each with each other because it's a thing that I go on. And that I go on in our society, 
Well, the thing don't look good. So no, that's no, why no. Saba Tooth have to do school girls and school boys. And me I try to sing the song also. How you go, Saba? How you go? Can we not say you are? How you go, Saba? It, it goes up. Labor for learning before you go old. Cause learning is, is better than, than silver and gold. Silver and gold and, go and money will fade away. But a good education will never be. I tell you something glad you called because we just want people to know so everything nice. Yeah, that's that. Come here. Yeah, and right. just before I go around, I want to make people know that so. Jamaica, there are 19 countries out of 17 countries around the world. Also, Jamaica was the biggest. Also, Jamaica was the biggest ranking country out of nine in the world in the 60s. Seen, meaning that in our economy, Jamaica, they have the biggest um, exportation within the economy, within the agriculture. Yeah. So, when we look around Jamaica, we see the crisis are going on. Jamaica need enough money and we have to check IMF and things. Man, I reach out right now, man, to, 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 to the leaders, man, from the prime minister to the opposition, on the farm together with the Jamaican people and utilize the land them with the debt run. Jamaica, all the Jamaica solution to get us out of this debt that we're facing is in our economy. Yeah, but we have everything else, man. Agriculture. So if we farm the land, we can't help ourselves. Big time. So I elaborate on that and, 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 and just bait it in them ears. Like a lick a lick a nail with the armor. Yes. And make us start yeah. farm the country. Too much youth now have no work and thing utilize the land. The prisoner them were there. A prison and jail. We are where we are live as them just want to kill man and shoot up people and go cock up uh, in a prison and uh, live like send them out, make them go farm the land. No yum and banana. And build the yeah. economy and make a revenue grow around more you Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And I make everybody call in and start support that Jamaica problem, Jamaica solution to get us out of this crisis that we're facing in Jamaica from the crime and violence to the war and everything is within our agriculture, our farming. Within our people as well. So let me give thanks to the link here, lad, and a good good talk you. Good talk, good talk, lad. Good talk, good talk, good talk. And uh, whatever we need, not tell us say this. There's so much here. There's so much here on the island, you know what I mean? But as a people, we have to learn to reset with mindset like Scratchy Law said. You know what I mean? Because leader them and look out for themselves, because you know? every politician rich, you know? So as Jamaican, like Damian Marley said, we have to set up shop. You know what I mean? And shop have to stock up, and it have to set up, and it have to write. So every day we sit down and say, we don't have no work. We have to find something for work. Isn't it? All right? It is 418. Step in. Take a short break and come forward. Where's the Sammy? Click it. All right, click it. For the aim, we're there and the art of war and a problem from Babylon. You heard that Mr. SSP Lewis supposed to step down. I'm going to retire or whatever they call it in a Babylon. Because Babylon have all kind of name for you, same thing, you know. Walk off your work. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Lewis, I'm eh, supposed to be leaving the work as far as I, I hear. I don't know. Uh, I haven't spoken to SSP Lewis in a while. And uh, we say the next man will take over from SSP you now. Name is a Lewis too again, you know. Mm-hmm. SSP Lewis has step out in there. SSP Andrew Lewis has come in, you know. <laughs> <laughs> come like, man, I had a step out. Andrew has step in, you know. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, but we are step differently. Good. Uh, well, yes, respect. Good afternoon. Step in. Ruta. Ah, to the world. How you do? Ah, uh, doing good, you know. You, you know what I tell you before me get to what I say? Yeah. You must have on one foot of the Flanders. One foot? Yeah, one for Rana, one for Ruta. Oh, okay. Can yeah, yes, sir. Yeah, because when my little boy grew up, he used to say, if you wear one foot of shoes, your mother would dead it. I mean, well, my mother did it. You know, I miss Pat said they'd left you. No, 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 no. I said, if you wear one foot of shoes, your mother would dead it. I said, I always remember that. No, no, go so, man. That's what? a thing, no, go so. You ever wear one foot of shoes, eh? Yes, man. And your mother still alive? Yes, ma'am. Okay, okay. Still all right. alive. All right. Well, that's and good then. And too. Well, that's good. That's good. That's good. <laughs> so, welcome anyway. to the step in. Yeah, I want, I want to talk about the little picnic them now. Oh, gosh. Because sometimes people will come on and say, boy, the big people them, they sit to it that the picnic them, talk to them when they see them on the road or in the bus or whatever, a road or whatever. But when you, the big somebody, talk to them, you know, 
it's like you put in your life in a danger nowadays not you yes can you see as you talk to them as you open them i tell you some bad road long like fire to town you know yeah, me and know, they tell me you say go well woman your whole if your days done long me live my life yeah you understand and that's so sad though don't you Hmm? And that's sad, that's sad. Yes, what we are going to do for bring them picnic? Look here, know. one out of ten you can see on the road. Are you hear them going and you hear them say, as they look around and say something bad and then look around and say, sorry ma'am, you know, one out of ten. You yeah. keep, no care what you are going to do. I don't know, I just, the Bible tells you about them, they tell you about them, you know. So, but remember when me a little boy go to school, you know, even when me I go to high school and stuff, one of the things that they always talk about at school you know as you see one child are so get out of line you hear them say boy i have no home training you know yeah, and that used to make yeah. you feel embarrassing here man saying i know home yeah, training yeah. and them time they yeah, get home training yeah no some of them is getting home training because of picnic they have picnic you see, uh, that's you find like that them the one that we, they have the rude one they were gonna get no training neither so they yeah. don't know if you train for them picnic and if you if you see them on the road I'll talk to them and then go home go tell them them parents come find you and cause you have to lick you down too yeah that too so you're kind of afraid to talk to so them so it's a society the problem not true it's like a community problem yeah yeah when you have some regular community meetings you, you, and talk yeah, about the community picnic, used to grow your picnic yeah the community you used to grow your picnic not that not happen again cause me afraid to talk to them when me hear them all on the bus me hear them with them out of it me just caught my ears Ah, sister, me tell yeah. you rough. But we it's can't give up, you know. We can't just say, boy, you no, know. No, but we because, have to do something. because, you know, you have to try sometime. But more time, but I'm, especially the boy picking them. Boy, when me, we take a chance and talk to the, the girl, girl, you know. Yeah. Me not go say to the boy, because me no want nobody kill me before my time. And that man. We still have little things we sample and, and experience and experiment before me did, you know. That's true, that's true, man. Me go and hold the peace. Yeah. But most um, Ruta, Ruta, a cut from Abba be a talk to you, you know. Pat, a long time when I hear from you, you know, Pat. Oh, then the minute I work for Ruta, I'm going to hear from you, you know, Pat. No, man, top of the night, can you give me one number where you're not answer? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm telling you, listen, ever since, uh, all right, you see, earlier on this year, ever since we got Barbados and come back, and you know, come let me have pure bad luck with phone, you know. <laughs> me left me main phone of Barbados, then we finally, Samantha, get it back for me through customs. It took me about uh, two months to get it back, Sammy. Then I had a different phone, phone drop a mashup, just get a new one, just a few days ago, and it drop a mashup too again. Mm-hmm. So nobody can find me right now. My, I'm coming to tell you, man, I try all the while to get you, man, because I know when me no, talk to you. No, we are original, you know, you are me original, you know, Pat. Of course, the before their business there. Oh, God, man, for, for <laughs> IRFM have me at work, so on late night. <laughs> hey, IRFM, the big night, Joe, kill me, you know. <laughs> <laughs> if they never move me up to morning, maybe it's night Jude, I can't be you know? I, I you know, so we miss you panda the, 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 the before day program. No, man. no, but I pray for me to go back to the center part, please. But, <laughs> mister, when you move, man, mister, I, I cry, man, I miss you, because I don't know about if you talk to you know, the before oh, day. Oh, true, true, true. I'm kind of when I look forward to today. Yeah, uh, man. Uh, yeah, 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 do the thing, man. Yeah, do the thing. Yeah, you know, let down the mood, All right, darling. You know, let me give that. Go on, do your thing. I'm glad to hear from you, Pat. Love. Yeah, time me, in a darling. You know me listen to you every morning, you know. All right. You, you know I eh? cry again, though? Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes, yeah, me, I wear me spots to get that little boy in the front, man. I tell you, I wear small I run. <laughs> you see, my father named Mas Jackie Mouchette. Hey, my father, te- Pat, my father tell me a joke quickly about my father. Hey, my father not easy, isn't it? Mm. It's like them tell me, so, see, back in the days, my father was the only man like a Westmoreland. Back in the days, we used to have care, you know. Mm. So people used to chat him, you know. Okay. And they said, they chat to my father one time, if he came out, woman go, I'll be a man, you know. Mm-mm. And my mother said, my father can't, woman go, I'll be a man, you know. I'll be a man gone in one place, you know. I'm gone, you know. And he, like, he don't want the money, you know. My father didn't just hold on to money, you know. So if you'll be a man good. He will finish what he lives. Yes. <laughs> Hello, your man is coming up. <laughs> exactly. Can you see not a who be a man no the boat? If uh, a man is no scared, then we know where they might do the, the, the lot of the lot of money you know they go up so far, you know. Oh gosh, every, man. every every week we do the one of them on now we <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, man. Right, so, Ron, big up yourself, yeah. man. And <laughs> me, me still listen to your man in time, man. Your sister Elise, man. I'm, and you know, why you big up in the, in the studio there? Ooh. Sammy, man. Oh, we don't know her, you know, but you know, too, we all not talk about Sammy, me And she's sexy, too, Yeah. Sammy and and you know, partner. and you know how she not feed you with the breast milk, what the year? <laughs> that the breast is the best? <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> but yeah, listen, yeah, listen. Big her up. Big her up. Give thanks, Step all in. All right. All right, Pat. Cool. Original listener, right? I tell you, so Pat, remind me of my days, you know, when we used to work. I, one time, hey, I, hey, 
You know, say RFM is a wicked station to me. You know, say station used to have me on for about six years straight. I just straight night. Yeah, man, sometimes I'll three o'clock it. Then come for me a rain and fall. You know, say, you know that big A is supposed to come to work and big A don't come. And me, they send final. If me the follow RFM, night you kill me in a summit. Me, I tell her, I said, that me the plan for God, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but as we plan for cut, you know, uh, and they said I'm going to move me up to the uh, she fell. Step in. Afternoon. Good afternoon. How you doing? Ah, uh, fine, thank you. Okay, you're doing a pretty awesome job. I just want to address um, the issue with the youngsters on the bus. Oh, that's a serious problem, isn't true? Mm-hmm. Well, I, once again, I think it starts from the home. And I think we want to encourage young people to see themselves as being important to the development of our country. Yeah, yeah. Well, well that's true. But I tell you the next thing again. You see, a lot of times you try with your children mm-hmm. and do your best at home, but you mm-hmm. see the outside influence and the peer pressure. That's the next problem, you know. I sort of don't believe in that too much because growing up, I had pressure from my mother and father above and beyond all. So. I was not affected by peer pressure because the pressure that they would lay. Yeah, well, the parents. Of course. Yeah, well, you had good parents, you know, I mean, most of us do. But, I mean, uh, for example, I mean, I don't like the, the, the talk that people have lately nowadays, like one brother calling the next brother dog. Like, what's going on, dog? What oh, well, dog? I, that, that one continues to baffle me, considering, yeah. um, you know, you don't walk on four legs, and I have yes. a pretty good looking dog in my yard, yeah. which looks better than most of them, so I don't know. Uh, yeah, it's kind of it, odd. It, it, it's, it's like. It, it's like for, for a lot of people, it's like the latest slang and stuff. And I heard my son the other day coming home from school and talking to one of his friends and saying, Yeah, me see you tomorrow, dog. I mean, I say, Hello. I mean, I don't talk like that. I mean, I try my best to teach him, right? And here he is talking to his friends. So, I mean, I say, You know. Well, I do agree that you can stop what happens during socialization, but you can take the time to make the correction. Thank to you say, very Okay, much. young man. I'm not a dog. Let's not use this. This is not correct. The word nigger or nigga, yeah. which they also like to use, is another one. And if you give them the historical background, these things, I think, is very important. Not just to say why you don't use it, but the historical background behind it. You know, that's very good, sister, because one of the things that uh, you find is that youngsters sometimes, if you take the time to talk to them, even to explain to them and show them from uh, maybe a historical point of view, or they, they will listen, you know. I think they will. Yeah, they will listen. Because guess what? We cannot give up. We were all young once, yeah. and we are now in our parents' position. So we have to help develop them so they can be the leader for this. I, you remember what our parents used to say about us when we were growing up? Uno hay worse. The same thing we're saying about <laughs> these children. <laughs> thank you for calling here. Have a good one. All right. Thank Bye. you. Step in Razor. Ran Mushadin for Muta Baruka. And today I call myself Ruta. Now this tune I'm going to play is by the man called Scratchy Loss. Scratchy Loss is a real good Rastafari elder. He's his little daughter. His name is Empress Reggae. And may I tell you, Scratchy is doing so well right now that even Scratchy Loss himself surprised. I mean, how many days he probably wake up and look in the mirror and say Rasta? I mean this. But Scratchy Loss has something very important. He's saying right now, as a people, especially African people, uh, we are powerful people, great people. Marcus Garvey said we have a rich history and in the future we'll create another one that will shock the world. Uh, you know what I mean? Even though a lot of us live in poverty, yeah, but we're not poor people. Uh, that's the situation we find ourselves in now. So reset your mindset and know that are we set the thing from the beginning. So do a road, man. I'm going to sit down and make Babylon take off your clothes. Now Babylon say I'm civilized. What are we civil white? I'll play the scratchy again. Step in, step in. Blessed, yeah. blessed, yeah, 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 blessed, blessed. Praise you, Jah, Rastafari. Rasta live forevermore, man. I listen last time first. Yeah, the Imperial Majesty, Emperor. I listen last time first. Yes. King of Kings, Lord of Lords, conquering Lion of the Tribe of Judah. Yeah. Elect of Jah, Rastafari. You know, say so I refer my loans are the only. How many stations we have in Jamaica? Whole parade of stations. Holy. And only one station alone, Jah named Carl Panena. But I tell you, so, all the newspaper them when I and I write them, yeah, them we are them not publish it. No, them afraid, man. Yeah, yeah that, you know, that's why Irish stand alone, man. So where are you at? Yeah, what? Well, no, no. Did you see the youth them? Yeah. Nowadays, as a as a big beef, I'm all about you. Say, I pick me off, pick me, you know. Yeah, man. That's one of major problem, man. Yes, Young so parents. That's a really a go on right now. Them not, uh, them grew up with no home training, and the youth them where them have worse. Yeah, so and, you can and, imagine the youth what them youth are gonna have. Oh God! And then one of the things we find that you know some parents you know I try to be friends with their children you know they don't want yes, a friend. So, yeah, a, a yes, parents they want that. you know you must be them parents you know they have to be them friends. Mm. Yes, I say. Yeah, but right, I know, Ruta, Ruta. Yes, I. Here, um, 
I want, I know so Babylon out there listening, you know, the government mm. and the opposition. Yeah, man. Babylon the people them. Them who are wearing the least money them as according to how them work. Yeah. They must suffer right now in Jamaica. Wicked, man. I tell you. Because right now, you saw Babylon deal with the thing, them raise up bus fare, and from the year start, you have one bag of price increase, rice, flour, sugar, salt, everything. And the people I must forget all the money right now. It's like them no want them no want to go to people them. Um. Wage freeze. Yes, what me I say? Yeah, you know, see Babylon and celebrate the so IMF so them pass the test, man. No, I mean IMF is coming like a slavery system, you know, come like and a, and a come in like yeah, and, and, come in and like, every time Babylon pass the test, they celebrate you know, like, eh, further them and sink with them in a whole I see them, them think that. Yeah man, they must celebrate, man. I see them think that, you know. But I but, I, but, I, but, I, but I, the finance minister the finance minister now used to be man within long locks of chant down Babylon, man. I do would ask them the man. <laughs> It's a chance, man. And then say, and then I see a minister and all the head shine like for me. I know. No, I tell you, I sell out them, man. But the one thing I want them to know right now is, you see, most of them youth are seeing them too now. Yeah. Big up, Jack Ewer, Spana Bana, yeah. Morgan Heritage. Yeah. We see the suffering and, and I highlight it to them. It, yeah. You see what I say? Them feels like to them too now, just go so. No nah, man, it, yeah, well, then and then you see the next thing again. We're going on again, you know. One time it, the, the people at the lower scale to get some money, you know. Babylon come with that thing where they wage freeze. Me not tell you, the little minimum wage people, them, them are wage for a little increase right now, and I know. Yeah, employers have got to do better because we eh? people were employers have got to do better, man. I tell you, employers but, have got to do better. Uh, it's a thing, yeah. It's a thing, yeah. Uh, Ruta. Yeah, but you see the Ruta, thing we don't watch them. We are watch them and I see them. You know? Yeah, but that type problem, Rasta. Can we sit down all the while and watch them? We can't watch them. We have to make something happen. Because if we just sit down and I mean, we just a uh, we just attack uh, and we we can't sit down and watch Babylon no longer, man. You see, man, them I get fat. <laughs> and we are uh, 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 we used to have a little saying when me a little boy I grew up in Jamaica. My mother, mother used to say, "Them one job, boof." Uh, and we uh, job. No, it can't work, man. We can't sit down and make money. No, man. We have to, no, man. Things have to change, man. So yeah, we, man, we, we the smarter ones. No, man. Yeah, it's we the smarter man. ones have to make something go on. Yeah. Yeah. And at that, me say. Uh, Straight. Step in. We give thanks in our Rasta. For yeah, man. Blessings. All right. Me, Keep on the fight. Yes, sir. I mean, even know what going on with some of the station. Hey, you see some station in Jamaica right now. If you all go up on the station and say, Joe, Rasta far and they send you home, you know? Like Damian Marley said, we're the last of the dying breed. See Babylon licking down and turning our prison, you know. You know exactly where we're heading. You know, GL, we are girls. Step in. Okay, like you step. Yeah, go ahead and tell us. What I think about Jamaica too again, you know. Phone company, my beat with body, you know. Jan, no, why me I tell us every minute to try to make a call here, man? Say, Jan, you know, I'm going to call you back when I have no credit. Yeah, step in. Good afternoon. Ah, oh, good afternoon. How are you? Ah, fine, thank you. How are you? <coughs> Not too good in the amount of the weather, but I have to hear your voice over the phone. Ah, give her thanks. Give her yes. thanks, darling. This is Irie Mooma. Irie Mooma. We step in, in the Irie. Yeah, me know you step in. Right, it's a sad day I for Portmore. I love that. I love the reasoning, you know? Yeah, it's a sad day for Portmore today. And I have to bury Mayor today, don't you? Yeah. Judge Very day. sad. Yeah, man. That is like a samba moment across Portmore now, don't you? Yeah. At first, that happened a long time in Jamaica. You know, like a, you know, like a sitting leader mm, drop out, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, boy, Mr. Lee. You know, easy, uh, you know. You didn't want to win back the election, you know? <laughs> yeah, not sure. <laughs> ah, Mr. Lee, I have to have some good laugh in my memory, man. Mr. John yes, Lee, then. Can you swear to take out Fatman? Fatman, in him again. Keith Hines? Yeah, Mr. Hines. Hey, Mr. Hines, you know, easy, you know, because they didn't hear him, sir, right? <laughs> oh, you know, him now go back into politics again because he's now a Christian and he's praising the Lord and the Savior and Ray, Ray, Ray. And then the next day, I see him on TV, I do interview again. And if he come out of politics, say, what kind of interview you do again, man? You know, go on a church, man. That's too terrible. Man sent down in politics, I didn't know nothing at all. Mr. Lee, they do, he man, said, do the circuit. Yeah. You know, easy. Right? Um, but, Ron, now you the program for Big Up. DJ Matrix. Matrix? When do you know? Now nah, big him up. Man. Oh, uh, you just love him. I tuned them when I play last night. And I'm uh, telling him under the weather, so oh, I'm going to get sleep, man. But him play some nice tune right up till I'm ready for come out. Wow. DJ Matrix. Yes, man. Yeah. So big him up, okay, man, listen to him. Big him up, man. Just do it. Yeah, do it again and hear it, man. Can you, man, I love DJ you. DJ Matrix, big up yourself, coming from Iron Mooma. 
right. I love it. The tune I made a drop last night and I before there. Alright. I remember love that in as a man love him big up you know. Yeah, right, I'm, I'm glad friend, to hear man. from you and the two you not hear me I call you know I'm listening every morning. Yeah, me know every man. I anytime I get a chance, we know I make a link, so we appreciate every morning it, you know? I listen. And stay strong and big up to everybody in Portmore. Big up Sammy. Ah. Sammy. All right. We can't wait for breastfeeding. Me no, you don't get to breastfeed. Me listen, man. I'll tell us every no, morning. No, me can't wait till breastfeeding month. Come back around next year. You don't know, care me asleep, you know. At 6 o'clock. Me wake up. Your eyes. I remember. Then you know, I remember, darling. <laughs> yeah. <we have laughs> Enough love to you, know. A bigger from yeah, sister we... Ellie's, you know. Come in here, girl, at you know. Yeah. Everybody, I'm telling you, Ari FM is something like a family. That's true, Ari. And that is why I love this station. I don't play any other station. That's true, true. That's why I mean, that vehicle, I can't pick up Ari. I'm so crazy. Oh, gosh, man. Sound like a Japanese radio. They're offering them one by one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Big up Kevin from CB, not the chicken truck. Kev- I know I'm listening. Kevin from CB. Yes. Yes, Kevin. Let's have two chicken in a day, you. Thank you. Thank you, Ari, mama. Over your head, Bobby, and, and gave you love. Then you showed us hate, Bobby, and, and gave you spices. You flavor your This is the energy of the Scratch your loss and Empress Reggae in the yard family. We step in and step in Razor. How you doing? Step in, step in. Oh, Sammy. Sammy, click it now, Sammy. Click it now, Samantha. Samantha. Ah, step in, step in, step in. Run. Yes, I. Why, man? Ah, they are stepping on. Why, before we even touch by the program, we just want you know, say the morning thing with your sister Ellie. Yeah, that look a reason in there. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, it, 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 it's a real energy in the morning. Ah, uh, give thanks. Because give here, I want to touch some point where I have to let them more time. In a taxi, I have to let the visors, right? You know, so the visors sound familiar, though. I mean, I used to play football for Irie, man. Play football for Irie? <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. Ask, ask Evan and Robert, I'll never tell you how. Oh, uh, you know, if I sound familiar, though. I mean, no, so I know that sound already, you know. I hear that sound yeah, already, you know. Yeah, man. Like I, hear dance, I hear a stone you know, around. I hear a stone around. Yeah, man. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's Japanese radio thing we had that, but. Yeah. Right now, we have one in America and our expander, we have to put on money for $1,000. And, and, and the expander now nah, gives the full length, because the expander not really, expander's not really work that well, you know, my dad? Yeah, because I get to 9.1, we have to put it on right now for listen to our FM. You know. And it's a serious problem, because how me for buy a car from, how me for buy a car, I'm buy a car, I can't, and the radio can't work. Yeah, that means I'm out there. some things that some people think, but a reality, I don't no, people I, understand what you're talking about. Listen, no, man, you see the radio, it's, it's the broadcasting commission, and then people that when them I sell you a license, they are, it's the radio spectrum, it's from yeah. 88 yeah. to 108. Yeah. In, that's what we use in Jamaica, and that's what we use in There's only one country with the exception is Japan. Yeah. Everybody else yeah, knows me, it. I don't see the reason why we are listening to other language when we're in Jamaica with it. No, not only we're that. Not but to listen, we're not supposed to listen to no other Chinese and Japanese and all that. No, but you see, you can't man. sell a man a product that can't work in a country. So when, when you go to car mart, you go buy a car for you, go say you can't pick up RFM or anything for 100 or anything. You have to just tell the man, say, oh, take this out. But I want to tell you, say, we take out the other one and go buy one run. Buy one in our shop and we'll have to install it no run. I realize that, yo. A Japanese see foolish. A, a Japanese radio. Yeah, that, 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 that go back to the custom people and the commerce people and the broadcasting yeah. commission again. Right. And, and they say, well, some things run and some people they but they don't understand the no, reality no, no, no. are dark. No, they don't realize what's going on. But uh, that is a problem and that, all right, all right, for example now, you yeah. live in America like a first world country and you go down a Toyota place to go buy a Toyota. You think yeah. you can sell yeah. an American man a Toyota car where radio can't work in there? You know, bring you back yeah. and say, man, nah, I don't want this, man. I don't want this man. This can't help me, man. Yeah, but when we do it at Jamaica, now you hear say a fight, we are fight against you, whatever. We not the funny media thing. You can't sell man. <laughs> yeah, and, and should be got two local radio station up at the eighty banner, and they get two listeners. Then figure say, uh, uh, and then birthday come. And I saw you get done. That's it. You can't, right. say, you can't tell people say, we must buy a license from, from you, from OU or whoever's broadcasting commission, and we buy a license from you. And we there are 107, and nobody yeah. can pick it up because you're low rate of coming to Ireland that can't pick up the station. I rubbish you know, that. Of course, I rubbish. And the next thing I want to body up on now, yeah. you must make foreign to talk. Stop going like Captain Burrell. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean by that? What do you mean? What do you mean? If I put say hungry, 
Find a crocodile give my friend him a restaurant and can't get the crocodile. Yo, what I think Jamaican man? Oh, oh, when we come start eat alligator rasta? Yeah, I'm shit. I don't know, boy. I don't know. Rasta, I tell you. Things of things that say, boy, I rasta. I don't know. I don't know. When yeah, I tell we, you. And I saw Jamaica. Jamaica? We are eat crocodile at the Ministry of Health after a warning if you know a man goes there. Man goes. <laughs> Yo, yeah, some man I'll, forget deep in a rasta. There's a man forget deep in a rasta. I'll snake man, 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 i will snake man 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 i will snake Shane, bro? Shane Clark. Oh, Shane, Shane Clark. Clark. Yeah. Shane Clark, man. Yeah, man. Hey. Eh. One thing. Finally, entertainment. The man in Alligator? That's what you tell me. No, no, man. No. Okay. okay. <laughs> 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 I don't want to pick up him and catch him up with the music news thing. You know what I mean? Oh, okay. And then okay. now, Sunshine, a.k.a. Do- Dora. With Shia Alico. Oh, God. With Shia Alico thing, they know. She and, she and Kashima up on Friday, you know? Yeah, they just... They don't do them little thing, you know? They take the music you know, news live. You know, there's something about the radio more time when people loving her, and I tell them, you know? Uh, I refer, man. You know, so I refer, so we work, man. Yeah, man. I, I, I'm going to tell you something, man. You get your bun out. I'm not afraid to call you, but I'm not going to do it for the program. The big band there up on up the football place, then. Yeah. You get your bun out, and you deserve to get bun, run. No, man. I bun me bun everything up at JFF, you know? Everything yeah, man, up. Yeah, man. If you get bun, bun, run. If you get bun, yeah, because you want to... In my shop beside. Yeah, man, the Jamaica football, uh, it could have been better. Run, we could have reached further than this and this one, run. Why the man in bad mind, Tuffy, so? Where Tuffy, Tuffy must be having some of the white yeah. fall up, 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 up the rest. Uh, uh, you can't that, just get up a fight at you, sir. I show them can't get fit, spin Tuffy on them finger like how they can spin to other player. Oh. Tuffy is like a garrison, man, you know. You haven't said Tuffy grew with a garrison, you know. Oh, so you okay. can't go, hey, hey, Tuffy, I want you to do, no, you're talking to Tuffy, you're talking to Tuffy like a real Jamaican. Well, like so, you uh, know, this uh, when I interview Tuffy, but Tuffy does talk like a real Jamaican. Yeah. Tuffy not pretty up, nothing around. So maybe that's why they don't want Tuffy eating no food. But I don't Canada know what it is, but that's something, though. They, you, there must be something why they, why, why they fight the youth, sir. Well, this, oh, you carry man go all the way to the United States and give him one six minutes. No, 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 Give me a man a long time, Tuffy want a visa, man, a 10 year Tuffy pick up. Don't worry about them, man. I'm going to fight Tuffy, Tuffy, all right. Tuffy gone through. Tuffy and his family can't go on vacation. Hey, I want to tell you, you know, the only way we have to have unity in Iran. We have to have some minister like man, like you, with us live for the people, man. Please the people, you know. Yeah. Right. Them, them are people where we have a chase and I go on like girl and I go on. No, them things are not put in our Iran. I don't even know. Me have to bring like, up. I have to bring on cash butter now and take a little time. But we step in uh, and we give thanks for the, for the thing, you know? All right, brother. Anytime, anytime I hear from a player, we're not gonna treat you like tough, you know? if I'm going to treat you like Tuffy, you know? If you come in, you get your <laughs> game, you know? You know that. <laughs> all right, the man. It's your phone. Dominos right. can't deal. Oh, yes, we did. By any need. And thank you very much. That was your afternoon 5 p.m. cash butt draw. Congratulations to all our winners. Tune in later at 7.30 p.m. for another chance to win in Pick $3, Lucky 5, and Cash Pot. Live only on Irie FM. Thanks to Sammy. Why well, I tell you? I don't know. Used to this kind of thing, Sammy. <laughs> Sammy, just bring him through word, but go on. Show me how to read again, Sammy. Tune in later at seven thirty p.m. for another chance to win. <laughs> yeah, go too fast. And pick three dollars, <laughs> lucky five, and cash pot. Live only on RFM. Well, I tell you, you're a good teacher. Ah, uh, what's the thing with the lady and the cash pot? I want to go. My lady say, and the look, cash pot number is nine. And my cousin would love buy cash pot. Jump up, you know. He says, ah, oh, six. Yeah, no. Nine a call and six hours. Strong man. Yeah. I strong man. They may eat half y'all get at them. And that lady. This is Juju Blood. And Wada Blood. Talking about the One Blood Junior. Step in. Step in. Step in. Go on. Go on. Ah, respect. 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 Yes, sir. Um, me, what, 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 what stormy a while ago, you see? Yeah. You see, you're, you're talking about... The, the, the boy I call him one another dog. Mm-hmm. But Peter Touch, sing one music so you can't blame the youth. Can't blame the youth. No, because we call our children kids. Oh, oh, you make a good point, you know, and, 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 and a goat have kids, you know. Yeah, man, a, a goat have kids, you know. <laughs> goat so, have kids. So, so, so we say, <laughs> man, still start <laughs> calling him youth and puppy. Yes, we call them cow too. Uh, because we call the children kids. Yeah. And uh, kids are the offspring of goat. Yeah, a true no daddy. So, a true so that's why they, they change the channel and call them dog. Uh, daddy, you know, see, so make a, a relevant point. Goat. Yeah, a true no daddy. So, a true so that's why they, they change the channel and call them dog. Uh, 
that they don't see make a, until, a relevant until, point. It might sound away, but that that's a valid point. That's a valid as, point. You until know what I mean? we do what is right, we can't blame them. True. That, that's what Peter thought. So you can't blame the youth because I can't do what they teach the, the teaching what they get. Yeah, because big people they hear going with them things, you know. I call each yes, other, you know. Yes. And I follow the Americans and call American children may be kids, but Jamaican children are not kids. Uh, children. Until we change that. Yeah. That mindset there and call with children. Children. Yeah, and stop calling them kids. That's true. No, we're born out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good thing. Yes. No, no more yeah, kids. Man. No more kids. Yeah, no kiddie. Kid, kids up on four foot and dogs up on four foot. That's true, daddy. Very important point, daddy. Very important. Me give thanks for that link there. All right. All, all right, right, daddy. Step right, in. Thank you very much, sir. Good. All right. Step in. The Gleaners Water Deal Heroes Day Sale. EFL. Ding, 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 whoa. Ding, 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 whoa. Rebel, rebel, rebel. Take it to the next level. Rebel, rebel, rebel. We're living at a higher level. Higher, higher, fire, fire. Bless up. This Bless is up, Jimmy, Jimmy Cliff. And you're listening to Irie FM. Yes, so, uh, wow. Wow. People stay shan, stay true. They didn't know where I'm going, Jimmy. They're not good here. Yo, yeah, no, man. Mm. Come like you work for Digicel for Donny Credit, man. How are you, man? Sorry, no man. Long sorry. The line, sorry, I'm not working for Digicel, man. I said that, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, one thing I want to say, you know. Yeah, say it. You know, say everything in a life, yeah. you have to have a, a, a surface ticket or an ID or something. Why why them children don't get ID before them can have a child? Wow, it's a different thing that you take with you. Yeah, ID. because look, look into it. If you want to go drive a car, you have to have a a I a, a, a if, you, if, if, if you go to college and you want to pursue doctor, lawyer, any one of them things, you, need you have to get to right, right, yeah, So yeah. why 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 children so free? Why? Where people just, children yeah, can't so free and it's such a, so much of a responsibility. Yo, charge me have three now. Remember me tell you, you know, I have to depend on my P and my Q, you know. True, man. You see what I'm saying? And the so bad me behavior and them things the, 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 the children think just too loose. In a Jamaica, not true? Yeah, it's loose, man. It's loose. I would just want the children first to know. Thing, say, first thing, all right. You said the big man himself, the, the, the content are 16. You, know? you think he's 16 year old that I can't tell him about, man? No. Eh? No. He must have got to college first. No. Yeah. So, all them, all, all them Lego, all our own name. So, we as a parent have to get smarter than them, you know. Yes, sir, man. The first yeah. time I call you, know, but you know, me listen all the while. I'm listening, yeah, man, respect, I'm man. Motor, but, it? yeah, man, it makes sense. But the, the children think you're not normal. You're not normal, man. No matter how uh, much time they talk about at the home. Sometimes you bring up you with them in some way where you, when you see them on the road, even shame yeah, as a man. You can't believe that they're not that. You love can't people, believe that. So oh, so them grow them yard. So no, them parents. And the parents. They even know. Listen, man. I represent, go represent my, my, my children in my school. And I said, you know, are you, uh, I don't mean, look for you, you know. Yes, sir, man. I said, I say, yeah, man, I discipline my deal with them, I'm not the foolish to them, you know. You see me? Uh, some some time time I sometimes say I'll represent some parents, when I know the parents are not good them that we do. No, man, sometimes I have some young ones that are going with a bag of things, yeah? But majority of them are old, you see me? Yeah, man, that's true, man. You have but some well-behaved children in Jamaica. We just want the children yeah. in Jamaica, you know, say, we the adults, we love one, you know, man. We want yeah, the man. best phone, you know, but you see the yeah, little man. loose behavior in a bus park. I mean, children don't respect school uniform. You remember one time, I'm like, you know, nobody seen your uniform, you know? That's cool, no, man. When That's school cool, over, man. you know? That's cool, no, man. That's when we cool, lose, pre- I mean, we lose respect for the flag. We That's lose cool, respect man. for the elders. We lose respect for ourselves. Now we but lose respect for the school, time, you know, the uniform. At the, at the same time, you know. I want to think more and touch upon, you know. I don't know if we the cutting. Here we say we now know the dollar, a slide. Yeah. And we now have enough US dollar in our country. You see me? Yeah. And still let a man can take up so much money for going to purchase uniform at Canada. Eh? Canada. For the BOJ girl, woman, them. Oh. Eh? So I want to do our thing. I went down, went down, went down. We represent our thing. I never hear the story. That, 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 that one is new to me. Well, BOJ eh, buy uniform of foreign. Eh, yeah, the BOJ bank um, purchase uniform of a two-year contract and then bid for some contract and it's a... A country, a Canada, a, a, a company, a Canada. Didn't you come to make good, good uniform, Rasta? Yes, sir, man. Sir. And, and remember, sir, we shot a foreign exchange, you know? Mm-hmm. Where the bank so of Jamaica now, shot a, you know? If them not leave by example, what we for do? Yeah, we cannot feed the money hmm? they must we spend. We shot a money, you know? I don't feed the money they must spend me, Dan, so okay. they don't read the business. I don't feed okay. the money so they must spend. Okay, so they don't business they do. No, man, they don't business with that, man. <laughs> <laughs> if I didn't feed the money, they go buy two clock down town, man, and build two shirts, man. <laughs> <laughs> and save. Yes, sir, man. You remember when the last yes, governor of the Bank of Jamaica left? You remember when, when you hear how much the money benefits and the money package where the money get? 
and then a new I governor. Do, I, I mean, do, and I even do. if the governor bank, I don't know. But as far as I know, before well, now, well, you can't check it out. You no, no, you. You no. Check what me I say is, as far as I know, the banker, the governor, the governor of the bank of Jamaica, Mr. Winter, mm-hmm. you know, as far, used mm-hmm. to live a hotel, you know, a hotel suite. He used to live in. I mean, I know if the government give him a house, I know, you know. All right. Are we a pay for hotel know? suite? You know? What me want to know? That, you just say we need to get the pandemic. Some- how can we come together when a man make an error like that? Can we call that error, you know? How can we stop him from work? And how we imply him? Of course. We suppose we can stop him from work, you know? Of course. But you see, because we're not united, Madan. Maybe you just yeah, have one no. or two people at town from certain civic groups come and call yeah, for no. his resignation. And maybe yeah, one no. little man from the JLP. And the rest of we just sit down. I'm going to tell me I see certain things. Come here, say, John, I'm going to say, John, I'm going to say, I'm going to call him to represent something. I'm going to say, bad mouth in time. I want him to call him. Belly, belly, belly. But we are feeling it in the background. We are feeling it in the yeah, well. The same as I look at me, the humble come and now I go and do my thing, have my youth. The man went to me, listen to me, and find out the foreign exchange I go. And then I'm going to take up so much. You two, I'm an oversaw. Because money have a trickle down effect, you know, it might not give me, you know, but the work when you do it will benefit me. Yeah, you see me? Because I'm an. A man saw so some clothes, he might keep a party for him, he might want a chef to come deal with it, isn't it? Ah, so me, I go benefit. Yeah. And then my people benefit, and then my wife benefit, and then my children. Isn't it? Them now look on the chicken down effect, you know, in other country, you know, they must have shoot out everything. Hmm? You see, Jamaicans. Oh, no, so thing, go. You see, we as Jamaican right now, we forget a beat, you know, because we are smart. <laughs> we are smart people, you know, we're creative, you know. Sometimes not now go on, we find some creative ways of making some little things go on. And the mm. same mind if you use and change the system, you know, and take yourself out of poverty, you know. I mean, some people just look like they just love the poor thing, you know. No, I don't love the poor thing, you know, because even, 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 even what you hear, Mr. Bunting, come with that thing, you know, my limit some spending and money and really. Mr. Bunting, all right, you know. Mr. Bunting, money can't come to you. Mr. Bunting, all right. 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 Mr. Bunting, no, but the man, the, the man, you can't talk to me about poor and hungry. You see, you understand what I talk about. Come like a Spanish, you know, you talk to me, you know. You see me, come and see your man for the bank in and go turn security. Only Jamaica, they're foolish, you say, can't go on, you know. No, no. If you be a security minister, if you have some security experience, maybe in the army, yes, you run yes, some security company or yes. something. You see me? Other way, they're not free, too. Other way, they're not free. I'm not telling you about bank, you know. I'm successful in a way you used to do. A Jamaican, a we make all of them things that go on, Dan. So we as Jamaicans have to look into ourselves and create a new day for our children and for ourselves. Well, I'm going to tell you something. Sure I work. Me, no, no, no. I'm sure I'm going to pop off and I will tell me I work for my own. You know. Boy, I'm putting in hard work every day. You know, and it come like you more your work. I'm more than taxi. You know. All yeah, the time I'm no, working, I, 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 I say a little bonus. We get for, it's all when we get a little pay at Christmas time and the boss at RFM give you a little bonus. Babylon tax all the bonus to you know, you. Let me not tell you, man. Remember, the last time my wife attack, I mean, I say, look like, you know, when you turn the two sides of the magnet, the more you push it on the next one, the more it bunks off. You come like other way there. Yeah, man. The thing I work with So, me. but we're not going to sit down and take that, because we are Jamaicans, yeah, and we're not take foolishness. So, a new day is coming, man. Remember me tell you, man. Yeah, man. I rest in control, you know. Yeah, man, a new day is coming. I me I equip me out them, and I educate them, and I Yes, sir. Prepare them. And prepare yes, them for the Gideon and teach them to yes, be strong, man. teach them yes, to believe man. in themselves, yes, and teach but them good money management up. and them things. Yeah, man, yeah, man. More, yeah, big up to my brother, my Carly, you know, I'm in a spoil in a hospital, you know. Yeah. I recover, yeah, man. What's your name? Yeah, man, from old Papa D, man. Papa D. <laughs> You are the first Papa D before the one where you all is. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> yeah. Yes, so, so, so yeah, man, Steve Campbell, man. I'm in the hospital. I recuperate your nose still, oh, you know? Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. I'm going to tell you, say, just tell you, them, say, the young you, them, the under 30, go down where I drive. You say, can't yeah, manage it. Take your time. Boy, I mean, I know Race I know. only at Dover. I lick a man. Race only lick at Dover. Ke- Listen to me, no, man. I can yeah. bet you said 90% of the accident when I go on in Jamaica with all in careless driving there. And I just youth factor, you know, liquor. Mm. You, you, you see the devil soup there? <laughs> a wicked thing. <laughs> yeah, me I tell you, it's devil soup. I tell Marshall, me please, right now. You know, see, we have more rum company in Jamaica more than anything else right now. Aho. Everybody has sell rum. A rum Aho. is a thing we put in a, a rum mash up with life, you know. <laughs> as as African people, you know. Mm. Because if you bought them from England, never want rum, you know. Would have never yeah, reached a complaint, you know. Yeah, man. So right yeah, now, me never want to say no rum. I tell you. Rasta leave. I Step I in. Step in. All right, Step in. All right. Cook no more. Give your dog the best nutrition every, every single, single, day. single day. With a careful selection of high quality ingredients in Purina Puppy Chow and Purina Dog Chow. The time by Purina Dog Chow is. Right now it is 5.23 on the Step in Razor. 
June plum juice. Evening January. Cherry juice. Without the hustle. Sour sap. The way you remember. Ten classic Jamaican juices blended by True Juice. True Juice. True Jamaican juices. Children, Dr. Alfred is going to teach us about strong, healthy teeth. Who has strong, healthy teeth? I do. I can take a big bite out of apples. <gasps> Mine are strong. I can't bite into sugar cane. And do you know why? My mom gives me Colgate. Right. Colgate contains liquid calcium and fluoride that gets between teeth, giving you maximum cavity protection for strong, healthy teeth. What makes teeth stronger? Colgate! With liquid calcium for strong, healthy teeth, Colgate, number one brand recommended by dentists. I have two loves, family and shoes. That's why I go to the BOGO sale of Payless Shoe Sauce, where I buy one pair and get another one at half price. Everybody loves Payless. Buy one item, get a second one of equal or lesser value at half price. Promotion valid through October 21st, 2013. Styles and colors vary by store. Digicel value turn up! Digicel is giving the best value on handsets all October. Buy $1,000 credit and you can get a brand new Samsung E1205 or a Nokia N100 for only $1,950. Plus, buy a SIM for $500 and you get $300 free credit. Offer valid while stocks last. Visit your nearest Digicel store today. Conditions apply. Text 131 to 1273 for more info. Digicel, Jamaica's bigger, better network. Digicel value turn up! Supreme Bench has a deal the multiple chance again. But this time on Pick 3, Pick 3 turn for the multiple chance. You hear me? At the Pick 3 multiple chance promotion. All you have to do is go buy your Pick 3 like normal. Spend $10 or more on the multiple chance. And you will get three more set of numbers on your ticket. The three more set of numbers mean more chance to win. So go buy your Pick 3 number them now. And get three more chance to win in the Pick 3 multiple chance promotion. October 6th to November 2. Domino's Grand Deal. Oh, yes, we did. Buy any medium cheese pizza. Where you get with your pizza? Cheesy bread, cinnamon sticks, bread sticks, lava cake. What? Only a grand? Mm hmm. Sides make it sweet. Or just a medium cheese pizza. Choose any side order for only a thousand dollars at Domino's. When we step out in the Christmas tree to save. Get it. Move your army. Tune up, pray, and I'm already in this dark babe. Get it. We don't have a step up less than the best of the show. Join the celebration at your favorite bar. Enjoy two for one Guinness specials and bucket deals. Spot prizes and even more vibe. Guinness, Christmas in the streets. Must be 18 years or older. Please enjoy Guinness responsibly. I'm glad to read all about it. Look out for the Star and National Baker Street promotions in Halfway Tree Bus Terminus on Wednesday, October 16 and Thursday, October 17, 3 to 6 p.m. With every purchase of the Star newspaper, you get a free pack of National Golden's Wheat Crackers. Offer good while stocks last. Don't miss this special offer. Check the star for details. The star for paper paper. Ramesh Entertainment and Right Image Entertainment presents Where and Every Water World, the Short Shots Edition. Come here, go a water world, my mind not change. Ladies, two for one before seven, not change. Me, I go on his place and go show me face. Monday, October 21st, not change. Music by Richard MC, Vance and Biggie, and Elusive Shane. Where and every water world, the short shots edition. Kyrie and lead. Them are the liquor station, now the roads like some liquor weed. I want to them indeed. Say that I'm real and organic, you see. Now, should in case you don't know who's talking so free, well, this is SSD symptom you'll see. Lazy Beth, Lazy Beth, what about that favorite? Lazy Beth, Lazy Beth, reparation we must get.
that till he's bed. This man is called Suits Cliff. Way up in the hills at the same time. The man said, Elizabeth, you want some money, you know? Yeah. Your Majesty, we're going to need some money. Elizabeth, Elizabeth. What about the slavery debt? Elizabeth, Elizabeth. Reparation we must get. So we understand that Jamaica's Prime Minister, Prime Minister, the Honorable Portia Simpson Miller, a.k.a. Mama P, uh, will be uh, inducted into the International Women's Forum Hall of Fame. Wow. So you are going, Mama P. Yeah. And if you get a chance to talk to Her Majesty Elizabeth, please. Let's tell her, say, we have a need. We have a need. We're forward. And uh, the Gleaners reporting today that uh, Dodos, Christopher Dodos, Prezi, Prezi has been transferred to a minimum security prison. Yeah, I mean, it's a thing's not so tight. The Prezi up a far in there. You know? Yeah, the great Dodos. Big up Tivoli. Yeah, they say beat up on it 5 nil the other day, don't you? I did it easy, yeah. Yeah, this is a step in raiser. Jamaican currency now 105 Jamaican to 1 US. 105. Wow, so we are going. Step in. Step in. Greetings. Greetings, greetings. Rastafari. 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 Jamaic up on the line, you know. What are going, Jamaic? Jama- oh, King Father, man. What do you want to say, Jamaic? Yeah. Jamaic, you never hear on the radio station, you know, you really must well, have gone good enough. You, you, you know, you know, so you know, you're on the radio station, there are a lot of things that you have to put on here and a lot of things to be heard. You know, no, Jamaic, why you call in on the radio, something go on, you know. What going on, well, Jamaic? Well, we have, we, have, we, have, we have three things we want to highlight. First, we should say thanks to the Islington um, youth group over uh, not see them go on good them them put them all them organization together and they meet now go on and the them was join up and the youth them just join up to the car when they have a move and let's have a group second oh. Sharp Park will be having their meeting tonight Sharp Park and with, yeah up a Sharp Park line top as the people them call we expect all of the youth them to come out and the people them to come out and share them views because them have a group but them group not really tight and the government won't come in now come assist some with some water and light and who relevant to get them tight and them things so we the people will sell and put the set together so yes, we expect like people just come out come do Shop that Shaw Park tonight? Yes Yeah, one of the people them going meeting up at Shaw Park tonight you know Alright, well on the other hand now you know it's one of Peter Tuck's son there in a jail Over foreign? Over foreign About 60 and pound of weed or something like that right, Yeah, so right now I just I just 40,000 US dollars have to get him out now so we are called for all the rich the rich American them that knows the right now we can have a celebrate Peter Touch birthday in a few days time we are saying sun round so for Ganja we can light up and where the man that says no you know aggressive move to get it legalized so and, I say if, you know, if, if, if you pay forty thousand dollars why he can't can get to come to Jamaica but yeah man he can come out man because him liar them everybody everybody are rally around it because a boy a two person you now him girlfriend and himself so he now come out leave the girl so that's twenty thousand US dollar each you know oh Okay, okay. But we are looking forward to the Peter Touch tribute this weekend on our West Maland in Jamaica. So I know a few replacing on Peter. Well, I want to say, I'm Friday, 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 i am friday i about 60 at pound we here and he mean some trouble up a foreign Peter Touch son and need some help. So like Jamaica say King Father, he yeah, was forty thousand dollars if he bust up a case. So I don't know, a foreign day. If anybody can help. You know, not true Jamaica. I was Jam- Jamaica, yeah, credit cut off. Why well, yeah, so we don't say anything I go on with it Jamaica right off the credit today. A big up Jamaica, it's nice to hear Rasta always working hard. You know, Jamaica is one of the first man that me feel like more go to Europe, you know. Yeah man, as a youth man. Remember we just come out here and Jamaica come back from Europe and I said, Father Ran, you know Paris me the day. And I said, Paris. Paris to the Jamaica. Paris said, Yeah, man, him and him girl they are Paris and Ray Ray Ray. So I said, What they I hold and kiss and them thing that they want. Jamaica said, No, can Rasta and hold and kiss. And I said, We will tell you, say Rasta and hold and kiss. Yeah, so I said, Wait until I touch Paris. You should have seen I up there. <laughs> I'm not a pigmentation. Even though France, you see, as, as Rastafari children tell me, I tell you, say, and as a man where. We love Haiti because you see, 
enough things we as Jamaicans hear about Haiti, you know, and we hear people talk about Haiti, but enough of we don't really know the, the real story, you know. Haiti is a warrior place, you know. Haiti is the first place to make black man know safe if you can get freedom, you know. Haiti stand up for we, you know, for the rest of we, you know, the black world, when we don't have nobody, you know. A Babylon pressure Haiti, you know. A lot of countries come together and decide, say, listen, no, no, we have to keep Haitians down because Haiti must be an example to the rest of the world. Said black people, you know, if you get up and come like you don't want to rule now, eh? You see me? Haiti was supposed to be an example. So all France, you see, look how France rich. All France make Haiti a suffer, say, you know. Because Haiti, after the man him go there and take over the Haitian place and the Haitian man him fight them out. France say, listen, you see, because we can't get for beating up and have to pay away your money, you know. So the man him have to pay them back over 100 and years. Whole heap of money. You see me? So Haitian economy just a bounce back right now, plus the earthquake. You know what I mean? And we run at this party come like we are scanning and Haitian them and we are calling them all kind of name. Yo, if I never did, we probably wouldn't even dare so now. So we don't work with the disrespect when it comes to Haiti. You know what I mean? We don't work with the yeah, all the obia talk them and everything like that. You know, cause, cause Haiti not good obia. Cause if Haiti obia did good, you gotta take out themselves. So nobody even tell me not about the obia thing. I mean I wanna hear that. Step in. Hello? Ah, step in down, step in. Hello? Hello? Yeah, we step in. Ron Mushet, good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine, you know, in the afternoon, 5.34, miss all the time check. Okay, right. I have an issue, you see? Yeah. We are living in the three years here in St. Mary. Yeah. And I'm telling you that we're having a problem with the water system. Oh, me hear about that all the while, you know. We have, we have been out of water for more than a month. The pump, um, they installed it um, on Tuesday, and they took it back out. Water condition. And they have us going around and around and around in circles. And there's no real representation. You understand me? Really when they were seeking election, they walk um, from house to house. And now you're not seeing anybody. Yeah, we hear about my land and all them places and have no water. You know. But rain fall. And look how close we are, we are to the river. Yeah, but mommy, here we are going now. You know, say if in that community, if we come together and buy one little water pump, we can, we can set something. Pump your water from the river and try to set on the cookie. Remember old time days, people have a little catchment, running house, I kept the water. Even washing and little things, we could have water. Because water commission, now nah, go on with nothing, you know. We could have cost them till thy kingdom come. It ain't always but a but pump problem. They have, they have this pump. Every minute it breaks down, you know that, they fix it up. Every, every minute day. it breaks down, they fix it up. They have the little pump down. It's like a little boy doing a big man work. Yeah. You understand me? It cannot manage the pressure. But with them and they need to do everything. something we'll about it. To them, the road is in the same condition. Not even donkey can walk on the road. At Three Hills, St. Mary. Three Hills, even um, from Three Hills, like you're going from Three Hills to Cascade or down to um, Mile Inside. Yeah. It's a, this, the road is in a deplorable condition. All right, we just will, I hope they just hear your voice, mommy, and see what can be done. Your representative, or, you know, and then even the people at Water Commission. But every minute, what, what Water Commission pump them can break them, sir? Every minute they set a fire for parts of pump. If you know you have a pump problem, you know, just get an extra pump or keep spare parts. I get a around. bigger pump. They can get a bigger pump. Yeah, and, and, and keep it spare will parts. avoid all of this problem. But we live in St. Anne, you know, our ocho rest where they say eight rivers. You know? Eight rivers. So what, man, we always have water problem. I don't know, mommy. We're we going to find a way to this problem. But we highlight it for you, darling, and see what we can get done here. Okay, have a good evening. All, right. Here. all right, you too, darling. Okay, and then. Bye-bye. Three hills. They need road, they need water, they need help. And Water Commission right now, may I tell you, say, along with JFF, JPS, trust me, right now, the ratings pop off. Caribbean choice, we take it in a flavor, we need in a spice, we take it in a Try all you politicians for selling out black people. In my court, only people, as I am fixed. This is a people's court. Now what you have here today? Well, your honors, we have defendants, Senator Sankey Singh and Senator Chin Jamai. Senators, here at the later yet we will deal with religious belief. All right, all right. Politician Sanki Singh, 
And politics can change my mind You are brought here For tricking black people By promising them good living every five years You have been selling out black people to paradise Your honor Hush up And not finish yet What you want to do? Promise me to I see the rich getting richer And the poor dying Your honor, fundamentally If I might say something at this point in time Shut up This is a people's sport, and I'm not allowing any politics in here. If you disturb me again, I will give you 1,000 years of contempt of court. You are also charged for charging people too much taxes because of your mismanagement, spending money then taxing the people for it. You keep borrowing money from the IMF and the World Bank in the people's name, continuing to buy the same colonial masters. Why you can't learn? No so-called third world countries have been able to break loose from these money hacks. You have black people in a vicious cycle. If it wasn't for me, black people in this country would still be worshipping the Statue of Liberty. Well, tell me how come All right, Joshua and the Great Blinds. What you trying to do? Can't so call it. Mukta Baruka. Thank you very much, Samantha. Thank you, World Cousins. Thanks to the whole team. It's been a real pleasure for me to work for Muta Baruka because, you know, Muta is a man that I have a lot of respect for. And I give thanks for the opportunity to be in here, even though even from the newsroom, I'm coming in a call, man, Ruta. Here it is. Yeah, blessed love. I stand by for live at 5.45 coming up next. So next week, Muta shall be here. So job bless. And I'm really happy for the opportunity. And so uh, I'll see you tomorrow morning.